In this video, I have to beat the one box challenge on every single Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Zombies map. Now, I'm sure you remember I've done the two box challenge in the past, so today we're making the difficulty a little bit harder. If you guys do enjoy this video, make sure to drop a like on it, and if you want to see more content like this, why don't you subscribe? It's completely free, and we are so close to 10k. With all that said, enjoy this video. Right, okay, welcome, welcome, welcome. We are doing the one box challenge on every single BO3 Zombies map. Now, what sparked this? What sparked this idea to make this video? Well, you guys seem to really like when I do challenges especially on black ops 3 so i thought why not we'll give this a go we've done the two box we might as well do the one box challenge and i believe that is everything open while i was yapping there all right cool grab ourselves the summoning key grab ourselves the pen we also need to have a look where the boxes are because i want to get over there as soon as possible i think that's by water for a bit weird but whatever all right let's go get this first ritual done because we are going to need access to the pack a punch machine i think i might spin for a shopping free and then try to get over to the box asap just for the sake of actually being able to do the challenge um i'm allowing myself to use some mega gobble gums okay let's jump down here Let's get this spun. Please, shopping free? No, nope, that's Perkaholic. I will be taking that, though. Here's the mystery box. Right, okay. We got one hit on it. Unfortunately, we don't have enough points, though, so we're going to have to kill some zombies. But this, I hate round one Shadows of Evil, bro. It's not even funny. They just take so long. Where's this last zombie? There he is. That wasn't last. Oh, we have this issue all the time, bro. Come on. There we go. Cool. I'm going to get all the beast mode stuff done here as well. Right, that. That open. Get the ritual door open. Nice. Oh, can we get the rift door open? Oh, oh no. Okay. Okay. I just need enough points for the box. Come on. There's our shield piece. Right. Okay. That works. Right. What are we getting for our one and only box hit? Come on. Please. Something decent. Please. 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 The bootlegger. Okay. That's solid, honestly. I was fully expecting like an XM53, though. I won't lie. And as always, the goal is just to get around 20. I've right, got a max ammo here. I am going to try and maximize it. Haha. <laughs> no pun intended. I'm sorry. I'll stop making corny ass jokes now. Right, come on. Give me a shopping free. Yes. Okay. Cool. All right, get that on. Open this door. I am going to go run around the map really, really, really quick. That open. We will also get this open. Canal district open as well. And this bit. Can actually also quickly get this open. Go. Grab this fuse. And I think that's just about everything that we can do. Okay, bootlegger. Solid choice, honestly. Could have been a lot worse. I think I'm just going to do the beast mode for this now. I know we need to do the other ritual over there, but might as well get it done now. Shock that. Head up here. That on. All right, that's that side of the map open. All right, and that is round. Okay, round four. 16 more to go. Right, let's go get the water from Ritual done since we've literally got everything we need to do for that and everything's open. I'm honestly so happy with the bootleg I'm on. That could have been so much worse. Also, I'm making it a rule that unless we're in dire, dire situations, like we have no ammo at all, we're not allowed to pack a punch or use this, the starting pistol at all. We've actually looked out as well because we can buy ammo off the tram. Gate worm, then run because the Margo's going to spawn. Okay, that's one of his heads gone. And another one. Okay, one more, one more. There we go. Death machine? Don't mind if I do, but I can't use this. Let's go get the canal stuff done. Done. We got everything open in uh, beast mode that we need to, so we just need, really need to grab the badge and just head up. All right, let's get this. Uh, I was about to say last ritual to the third one, bro. I'm getting way too ahead of myself. Okay, we're out of ammo. All right, things have not gotten dire yet. We can chill. Well, that was really easy. I always forget how easy it is to actually set up on shadows. It's just really long. I reckon we can get the next one done as well with no ammo. I think our last one's footlight. Yes, it is. We actually still need to run and do the beast mode for this. Jump up here, knock that down, and shock this on. All right, nice hairpiece. Oh, we still we still want. One knife with Widow's Wine? What? I thought that stopped on round three. I have only just clocked there's going to be a Margwa spawning, so we probably might want to, like, make a dash for Pack-A-Punch as soon as we finish this. Bro, I have had such a long day, man. I've all I've wanted to do is record, but I've had college. Right, okay, that's that done. We need to really quickly grab this gate when we get out of here because we can't use this pistol. Right, I need access to the nearest rift portal, like, now, bro. I think the only one we have open is, uh, canals. And we got to do the final ritual as well as also these... Hurry up. There we go. Bro, let me through the walls gone, please. Okay, put this gate worm down. This one down. This one down. And finally, that one. All right, okay, let's get this ritual going. Right, okay, we literally did that with zero bullets. We need to run the pack a bunch now. Stick that in there. There we go. Pack a bunch bootlegger. Oh, I am chilling, bro. Mr. Margwa, eat a bullet. Oh, uh, bro, he just stopped like midway through his charge. There we go. That's another Margwa down. Pick up the Margwa heart. Why not? We're not going to use it, but you know. Oh, we should probably double pack the weapon, actually. So I get like dead wire or something. Watch, we'll get turned. It's a B round, okay. Fireworks, I will take that, honestly. Hands down have to be the worst thing they ever added in BO3 with these stupid bees, bro. Right, okay, max ammo, thank you. Right, now we just gotta kind of survive, honestly. We can get the civil protector, and we should probably maybe work on the swords. It's something to do. Get that on, that on, that door 
open. Turn this on. I think that's pretty much everything. Oh, we haven't got the canal. This little bit up here open. Hang on. Maybe we can make it. That on. That on. Yeah, there we go. I think we're pretty much done for all the beast mode things. How's a double point going to spawn over there? That is the ultimate troll ever. Stick the fuse in for the civil protect. Let's go get the other ones, actually. And that is round. Okay, round seven. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Right, okay, there's definitely a fuse across that bridge. And then there's one of Footlight, I think, that we've missed. Oh, wait, did we grab this one? I think... Oh, yeah, it was like... I think it was literally the only one we did. Right, okay, let's go check water for now. This door open. It should be somewhere around here. Oh, no, it's nine years away. Right here. There we go. Max ammo. Perfect. Well, they're spawning so fast for round seven. We should also probably look into getting dead wire. Right, okay. It's another round down. Almost, like, literally halfway there we've been playing for like 17 minutes we're making really good time get this door open and there's our third fuse nice We'll go pop them in in a second. I just want to kind of build some more points just in case we have to re-roll for dead wire. We also are running a little bit low on ammo, so we're going to have to watch out. We'll be fine. Oh, a nuke. Perfect. Okay, round nine. That's a mog. Oh, he could, he could drop a max ammo. Actually, we need to kill him. Make that a priority, bro. Where is he? There he is. Okay. All right, let's run past him quick. See, we can't... We're allowed to buy wall ammo if it's a wall gun, but the problem is the only wall buy for this is on the train oh my god there we go last literally the last three bullets killed him please drop max ammo a death machine okay oh we should also look into getting the shield build actually we got the waterfront piece let's go look for the can is there one in canals i don't actually think there is so one in footlight i know that for sure yeah there it is i think that there must be one in canals right round 10 okay meatball guaranteed max ammo okay good 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 but where is this shield piece oh we're just gonna have to like knife the meatballs that's really annoying oh there's the shield piece i'm looking right at it and there's our max ammo i just firmed like a thousand meatballs to the head but it's fine. Get that door open and then we'll go build the shield. Probably is the best place for it here, like. Alright, nice one. What a weird design for a shield, man. I want to know who it trailed was like, yeah, let's add rocket thrusters on it. Must have been a weird day at the office. Okay, things are starting to pick up a little bit now. Not too much, but you know, it's around 11, so. That wasn't last zombie? What? Oh, there. There we go. I always seem to have that issue on this map. If anybody in the comments knows like a little bit more about how like zombies works from a technical standpoint, please let me know why this is. It's always on this map. I can never find the last zombie. I can see ourselves making a trip to the uh, tram here because we are running low on ammo again. I thought this thing had a lot more ammo than it did. Oh, never mind. Max ammo. Okay, right. Let's use the remaining clips that we have. TRX will. Thank you for subscribing. We get a full clip. Yep. There we go. Grab this. And that, my friends, is how you fully maximize our max ammo. You'll be a bear zombie player in no time by watching my videos. Trust me, I'm the best zombie player ever. Haha. <laughs> I totally got round 100 on this map. Right, okay. And that is round, round 13. Not too bad, not too bad. I've never actually watched a pod mutate before. That went from red to purple i think in the sky is so creepy man you never actually pay attention to it in the game because you've been more focused on you know killing the zombies that are right in front of you it's a cool hitbox though no not a hitbox a skybox sorry coming back to this game after playing like oh i just used the blood hound there i didn't actually mean to that was muscle memory i apologize slate me in the comments coming back to this game after playing so much of bo4 it makes me realize how well they actually perfected like complication in zombies because don't get me wrong bo3 for the first time is no easy feat like the easter eggs are pretty challenging the setups on some of the maps are pretty challenging like the, the bows and all that stuff but my god is it so much simpler than bo4 man like i'd argue bo4 is what not to do for complexity like that, that that is where you're appealing to literally only the hardcore audience if you get what i mean and that is round as well round 14 okay we're, we're speed running bro and that is two purple pods i might start harvesting these actually because we might have the chance to get a max ammo i am just holding off buying wall ammo as well mainly because it just makes it more challenging some zombie points or whatever that is that is a carpenter. I really don't want that, to be fair. Ah, oh, that's a nuke. Okay, that's not going to end the round, unfortunately. Got another purple pod here. Watch, you'll give us the Mogwa tail. Watch. £10. Never mind. A fire sale. A drop I literally cannot use. Thank you. Another issue that I have with BO4 as well is that I just genuinely feel like I can't hoard on that game. I don't know what it is about it. You've just always got to be running about, and it's prob probably because they made the Easter eggs so long. You never sit in one place. Okay, we have 27 bullets. We might have to go make a trip to the train. We'll see how this round goes. It might be a B round, possibly, maybe. Yes, it is. Okay, that's a Mago as well. I'm gonna spin this pod here. Spin this pod. What am I saying? Man of War. I would happily take that if I could. Can't believe I'm actually having a knife, bees. Come on, where's this last one? Yeah, there we go. Cool. Zeno matter, bro. I can't build the apothecary servant. This isn't fair. I need to kill this Mago now. Oh, right. Okay, there we go. He's dead. I don't know why he took so many bullets. I also was reading your comments on the last video, and a lot of you have said I've not done a BO3 eggs video. Now I have. I just haven't done it vanilla. Is that something you guys would want to see? 
Because I am really thinking about making that video. It just, you know, I don't want it to feel the same as the other ones. Because I've done it with BO2 guns, but just not, like, you know, vanilla. Okay, we're out of ammo again, bro. That did not last long. Right, okay, I think we actually are going to have to go make a trip to the uh, train here. I don't even know where it is, though. Oh, it's right here. Perfect. Unless, 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 unless we get it from a purple pod, which I'd be more happy about. Nope. Oh, oxygen tanks. Mint. Gaming station. Thank you for subscribing. I just got hit in the face with a meatball for you, bro. Someone's going to take that weirdly out of context. Oh, my God, I get it. Alan Dismal. Well, oh, I can't, I'm not going to even attempt. I'm, I love your name, bro. I, I do. I just can't pronounce it. Oh, another max ammo. Perfect. I'm aware we're right next to the wall by, but, you know, the RNG is just on my side, clearly. Hence, how we had to buy some wall ammo literally five seconds ago. Surely, we're nearly there with this round, right? I feel like we are. Come on. No? Yeah, there we go. I never realized that the Sten just has no ammo. Margo technical. Sure. I mean, we've got all three pieces to build it. We're just not allowed to. <laughs> bro, I'm like 180 in these zombies, bro. Bro, leave a like on the video if you remember zombies trick shot. That only just popped into my head there, and we are almost out of ammo again, bro. This thing has nothing. Oh my god, we ended the round. We're one, one round off, okay. Okay, let's go buy some ammo, and let's, like, regroup our minds, you know, chill out. We're chilling, bro. We're chilling. I am aware I'm just saying words. Grab some ammo. 4,500, bro. Cost of living's affecting zombies. You're gonna get that one guy in the comments, um, actually, it's because you pack a punch your weapon. Like, I get so many comments on my BO2 video about that. It's like, you can't do the BO2 egg solo. It's like, bro, I literally say at the start of the video that it's modded. Definitely need to find a new series of videos to do. Not necessarily like, oh, I'm going to stop the long form videos. I'm just on about like, so we've done all the Easter eggs. We're doing challenges now. But now what? There's going to be something else we can do on every zombies map, surely. I'll figure something out for you guys. Don't worry. Come on. We must be nearly done now. Come on, I want to knife the last one. There we go. Round 20. Okay. Right. We're onto the giant. But I don't think I'm going to use Mega Gobble Gums on that one. Mainly because it'll make it more challenging. Plus, there's like five perks on that map anyway. Right. Okay. Here we are. The giant. Nice and simple. At least I think it is. I know it is, bro. It's literally just dirt, Reese. We're chilling, we're chilling. We just gotta see what the box is. It's over there by the power in the OG location. Bro, they are all pouring out of this spawn window. What is going on? Good to be playing the Ethan map, though. You know, although it was definitely a weird change, the MR6 definitely grew on me over time. Right, we just kinda need to build up points. And like I said, I'm not gonna really rely on Mega Gobblegums for the Giant, because I think we should be alright without them. The map's tiny enough anyway, so gonna have to melee up until we get up to the box, though. Oh, insta-kill. Perfect, bro. Right, okay, round three. We're not doing too bad. Bad. I feel like things are going to get a little bit annoying though because we're, like I said, we're not going to be using Mega Gobblegums and we don't have any ammo on the MR6 anymore. I suppose we could use utilize? Utilize grenades. I'm slurring my words because of how tired I am, man. Is that max ammo? No, it's a double point. That is very useful though. 3k points. I'm looking for about like 4 or 5k though just so we have enough to like hit the box a couple of times. What am I saying? I'm not allowed to hit the box a couple of times. I remember once. Oh, max ammo. Perfect. I can actually use a starting pistol again. We can use the points we save up to buy perks and stuff. And there we go. That is round 3. Three done. We have 5k points. Let's get these doors open. And without further ado, let's have our one and only hit on the box. Please, something decent. Please. The Brecci. Okay, okay, okay. I like it. I like it a lot. Right, we've got Juggernaug in there. That's a bit useful, actually. Right, let's go ahead and get this teleporter link then. Bro, the Brecci is actually one of my favorite weapons in zombies. It's just so satisfying to use, especially with weapon kits. That fast reload without pack a bunch of Oh, bro, it's amazing. Carpenter, I do not want to grab that. It's going to slow us down hard. I am going to quickly run and grab quick revive it's just here and then juggernaug's down there speed callers over there that means double tap must be in the og jug spot god these earlier rounds are killers man everything's just so slow very happy with the pull that we got though should easily be able to make it a 20 with this okay that is round okay round five for this door open and we'll also get this other one open and get zc or za why do i always get that mixed up this is za nearly there and that's the second one on okay we got double points that's kind of perfect actually because we need to start building points for packer Punch, perks, all that good stuff. Try to get as many headshots as I can. Okay, 3,000 points. Not too shabby. God, this weapon is so satisfying, man. That's a nuke. We also get a bonus 400 points here. That's a max ammo. Look how optimized I'm being, bro. Reload, pick this up, then grab this. Let's get the third teleporter up and running here. Oh, we got a dog round. This map and Horizon Drac will be getting round skips, which is quite nice because, you know, dog rounds. And also a guaranteed max ammo is also nice. How many carpenters does the teleporter thing want to give me? All right, reload. Go pick this up. And... And we'll also grab Juggernaut, because why not? Right, round seven. Got, like, 13 more to go. Yeah, I can math, bro. It's a weird detail that they put the mob of the dead plane on top of here. Everyone started going insane about that, because once you finish the Shadows uh, Rituals, I'm pretty sure it flies over the map as well. Right, okay, I think I'm going to make Pack-a-Punch my next priority, not perks. Actually, I'll see how we are for ammo, because if we've still got loads of ammo, this is still one shot, and so I feel like it'd be a waste to pack it. An insta-kill here. Very nice. Right, okay, that is round. Round eight. 
We're getting through this really quickly. We've literally been playing for 10 minutes. I wonder when this thing stops one-shotting. Okay, we're doing all right for ammo as well. Honestly, this probably could have been the best pull we we're going to have this entire run. For all I know, we could get the XM53 like f f 14 times. I got max ammo here. Not going to pick it up just yet. Grab it. There we go. Basically cleared out an entire round there, I think. This thing's like a sniper rifle, man. Okay, and that is round. Also, there's a carpenter there. Not going to be picking that up because that's just going to slow us down. And why not? Ah, I thought I was speed caller. It's about to pick up mule kick and I can't even buy a third gun. There's speed caller. Thank you very much. Since we're all right for ammo, I think I'm just going to grab my perks and then we'll get pack a punch. Also, double tap two. It's going to make this so much better. And that's all of our perks. Very nice. God, I love how simple this map is compared to Shadows of Evil, man. Like, don't get me wrong. I'm not a Shadows of Evil hater by any means. Well, ish. My opinions on the map differ depending on whether or not I'm recording. Personally, I just don't find it enjoyable unless I'm doing some sort of challenge on it. But when you want some, like, BO3 simplistic fun, you just whip out the giant, bro. Even Dorizen Drax. I don't think the bows... The bows are difficult, but they're not that hard to learn once you get them down. Surely it must almost be end of round now. Yeah, there we go. Round 10. Halfway there. Let's go. You know, technically, when we do one of these videos, I'm... Oh, so there's 14 maps in BO3. Technically, I'm surviving, like, 280 rounds, bro. Put that into perspective. Then again, it is, like, the same rounds over and over and not like one consecutive game but this is still sounds cool oh they really do just pop like balloons man all right max ammo again nice okay we got a nuke there i'm not gonna pick that up i don't think i'm gonna pick that up at all actually if we want speed we should really be sitting in spawn because i think in the giant that is the fastest location for zombie spawns but you know what bro i'm chilling camping on the catwalk it's a little bit boring so that's why i'm staying down here but also i feel like going to spawn would just make this far too quick an insta kill here very nice and that is round speaking of far too quick man jesus Definitely need to start watching my back because they're sprinting now. There's no shield on this map. Personally, I think adding buildables to this could have made it quite cool. You know, just the shield and that's it. Not making it too complicated. Got another nuke there. And a double point and a death machine. Right, okay. We are running a little bit low on ammo. I think I'm just going to go chuck it in the pack a bunch machine a couple of times. Try to get dead wire, you know. You know how it be. There we go. A stellar screech. Come on, dead wire first try. You know you want to give it to me. Thunder wall. Come on. Dead wire. Perfect. Jesus, this thing isn't half loud. I do make the game audio quite quiet in my videos, but like, that's like hurting my ears, man. Okay, I'm going to try to use this ammo that we have now to our fullest potential because we have got another max ammo there. Insta kill, bro. And that is round. Round 14. Okay. But who's trying to ring me? Okay, we got a free round here. Very nice. And a max ammo again. Perfect. Bro, we are easily getting around 20. I feel like a map like Nocta and Total, now that I think about it, right? That's actually going to be really hard. We have no perks, but we have the Wonderfizz, to be fair, but that's heavily reliant on RNG. I might make that a little bit more interesting and just not allow myself to have perks. I feel like it's not really Nocta and Taunton if you have access to the entire perk library, if you know what I'm saying. Oh, God. Oh, that nuke came in clutch there. Surely we're nearly at the end of the round now. Come on, where's this last zombie at? I know you're around here somewhere. Where are you? Bro, he's actually hiding from me. There he is. Right, round 16. Okay, dogs are starting to spawn now. Not that big of a deal because they're not that scary in this game, just I didn't think that started so soon. I think it's one of them things that, like, differentiates every game. It's like sometimes how zombies will be spinning on round 4, sometimes it's round 6, you know, that kind of stuff. Like, how dog rounds aren't around round five sometimes as well i've always wondered why that happens bro these zombies do not stand a chance against the brecci oh max ammo again the game just wants us to do the game just wants us to succeed okay we cleared our round there round 17 and we also got fresh ammo one box challenge who you know bro i'm winning against the most rng related challenge ever I feel like these are the rounds where ammo starts to become a little bit of a problem though so i'm gonna keep an eye on it we should get a dog round soon though i've also noticed with shotguns you don't get dead wire near as often it's really weird might be because we're just using this weapon and not our secondary because i know it's something to do with that as well don't really understand how aats work in this game though saying that bo4 is a whole different ball game with them apparently and i really don't understand how they work either so because they changed so much stuff because they realized how overpowered it was in this one and i'm not just talking about the terrible names they gave them and that is round 18 oh my god okay we got about like 83 bullets left i think that should hold us over maybe i say this a lot and it usually doesn't so maybe take this as a warning I'm trying to do like a one shot one kill for every zombie but it's getting a bit more hard because they're all sprinting at me now. Oh, never mind. Insta kill. We're chilling. I try to save as much ammo as possible by knifing. No way we clear out around with this insta kill. I refuse to. But oh my god, bro. I'm the best zombies player ever. And our last round's a dog round. Could that be any more perfect, man? Why are they spawning in so slow? Come on, bro. I got places to be. Got a castle to go to. We got a remote island to go to. Stalingrad. Space. And there we go. There's our max ammo. Let's grab this. And round 20. There we go. Right. That's with the giant done. On to the Drak. Right. Okay. The third map. I think. Der Eisendrak. Let's try to get a little shopping free here. That's not looking promising. No matter. We will press on. Okay. Problem is with DEs. The box is so far away. So I'm saying shopping free is definitely fair game here. 501st boy. Well, you're not 501st, but you're like 8,000. But 
anyway, thank you for subscribing. There we go. That's round one over and done with. Come on, give me shopping free. You know you want to. That is not shopping free, little bro. Okay, I may or may not be using a round robin, you know, just to get another hit on the gobble gun machine. Oh my god, round three. That was so quick. What the hell? Nah, this is fair game. That's the only time out of like any challenge I've used a round robin. I just want to be able to get in the box, bro, and actually start the challenge. I swear down. The game hates me. It's fine. We'll just go down on round three because it's like probably gonna end up being karma. Oh, double points. How did I almost miss that? Oh my god. Bro, I'm actually getting cornered by round three zombies. It's just a tram fuse. Grab this other one. Come on, max ammo. No, insta kill. Okay. Right, shopping free. Finally. We have 6k points, though, to be fair. Right, let's go. Shield piece is just here. I need to remember not to pick up the HVK because of muscle memory. That open. This open. Power on. Right, the odds of us getting the teleporter door open are very, very slim. I'm still going to try, but it's not looking promising. Oh, it's going to be very close. Oh, just about. Holy. <laughs> they don't call me shopping free Roman W for nothing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that, that, that made me feel good. I need that little pick-me-up. Okay, we need to hit the box, bro. I'm so sick of knifing and having no ammo. Right, what are we going to be dealing with for the rest of this game? We are not allowed to use the bows just whenever we get here. The BRM. That's the most basic weapon I think we probably could have ever got. It's not even, like, interesting either. It's just, like, a slow LMG. Eh, whatever. I'm complaining, yeah, it could have been, like, the Shiva. Good about this map, though, is that it actually has a shield. And there's the second piece. We don't even need to worry about the dragons. We can just keep pressing on. We haven't grabbed any perks, though, so let's go grab Jug and uh, Quick Revive. And maybe Speed Caller, since we've got an LMG. But to be fair, the weapon kit does it justice for now, so I think we can just chill. That zombie came out of nowhere. Here is Jug and Quick Revive. Nice. Honestly, I'm kind of happy with the BRM. At least I know it'll kill them eventually. Like I said, it could have been like the Shiva or the RK5. Is the RK5 in the box? I feel like it is. I'm pretty sure I just saw the shield visor appear. Yes, it's there. There we go. We got the shield built. God, when you remove like the bow quest and everything from the Rising Track, there's really not much to it, huh? We could do Ragnaroks as well. Doubt we'll need them though. Do we need to get Pack a Punch on though? Weapon kits are definitely saving me here. Fuck it, we'll grab Speed Caller as well. Instill, very nice. Come on, where's this last zombie? There he is, nice. Like I said on the giant, dogs are also on this map, so we're getting round skips. I'll end this round and then teleport so the spawns aren't slow. But you reload so fast with the weapon kits on as well. Okay, max ammo, very nice. Let's head over to Rocket Test. Teleport these Pack a Punch pieces. There we go. And the last ones are up by the death ray, but I'm not going to craft it until we actually want to pack a bunch because it'll start moving. See, big brain moves from me today. You know, my two-hour sleep brain. Carpenter, I am not grabbing that. It's going to slow us down. I wonder when the BRM actually starts dropping off. Oh, and actually, I kind of forgot this gun is technically a wall buy because you could do the Easter egg where that little slate like, comes up and there's a BRM there. So if we ever run out of ammo, we're chilling. Come on, end the round should be soon, right? Go. It's going to hold off on pack a punch just for now. I'd say we're pretty set up, though, for someone who doesn't want to do the bows. Oh, that's a nuke, bro. Why? Okay. Yeah, yeah, the no widow's wine thing is probably going to end up cooking me over. I am going to go chuck this gun in the pack a punch machine because we've got the point budget to do it. How did the Origins pack a punch machine wind up here? Oh, that blue looks rank. Come on, give me a, give me a better color than that and a good pack a punch variant. Okay, the green and blast furnace. Not bad. You get a lot of ammo when you pack a punch the BRM. That was a really late blast furnace. Oh, bro, max ammo. I reckon we should also go down and grab double tap. I'd grab stamina up usually, but I'm just not feeling it today. And that was round, bro, round 10 already. Jeez, we are speeding through the rising drag. Then again, the pack Hands on my absolutely obliterate us. And here's double tap off. Fourth and final perk. Another max out bro. It's actually insane how fast this thing reloads. Like, look at that, man. Another cut, bro. Stop giving me common. And that is round. Okay. We got the Panzer coming around 12, which honestly, I think we should absolutely take care of them. We got double tap two. We got an LMG. We got an AAT, bro. Just listed off a bunch of letters, you know, acronyms. I'm sure you guys understand. We're doing well, though. I doubt we're going to be running out of ammo. Maybe LMGs are the meta for this challenge, honestly. But the one box challenge ain't got nothing on me. And that is round again. Jeez, man. I know I jump cut a little bit, but honestly, it's not that much time in between. I'm just kind of headshotting zombies. There's not many of them either. All right, there's the Panzer. Ow, there were shock charges hurt. I have had a bad track record with shock charges. Oh, bro, bro. BRM, you're not this good. Got Ragnarok part. Insta kill. Oh, bro, he's on knife now. Even more ammo conservation. I'm 13, bro. I, I, are the spawns on this just like ridiculously like compact? I feel like I'm killing like four zombies and then rounds over. Dog round two, man. What can I say? And there's our max ammo. We reloaded. Yes, we are. 700 bullets is actually crazy. Well, 800 if you include the uh, mag as well. Not a bad LMG at all. Maybe I like have been treating this thing wrong for its entire like lifespan from 
2015 to 2023. So that's like, what? Eight years now, bro? Don't make me feel old. The day this game turns 10 years old is the day I think I'm going to have like an existential crisis. Another max ammo, man. It's going to become a mini death machine real quick. Hang on. Speaking of death machines, <laughs> quickly reload, grab this. And there we go. That is round. Round 15. Five more to go. Well, four, kind of. Five? I don't know how it works. We don't survive round 20. I have actually criminally underrated the BRM for its life cycle. I think it was just down to its fire rate, but double tap kind of fixes that. I refuse to believe that's round. Bro, fucking hell. You might have noticed as well, I've cut down on swearing a lot. At least I think throughout these uh, first couple of maps. YouTube doesn't seem to like when I swear, because I swear a lot in my videos, and I do know it can be a bit excessive at times, but it's just like kind of my vocabulary, but YouTube doesn't seem to like it anymore, so I'm going to have to either censor it or just completely cut back on it. So I think I'm doing pretty well. Leave a comment down below if you think I am. And any ones that I have said have been censored, so. You know, there's probably like videos on YouTube that have had way worse things than swearing in them, you know, like the world tragedies, all that stuff. Yeah, yeah, that's probably monetized, but nah. Beating every four, sorry, beating every BO4 Easter egg in one video, you you're swearing, bro? No, 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 no money for you. It's whatever, though. I made that video because I wanted it to do well for the channel, not because I wanted money. Well, I do like money. I, I, I'm not going to sit here and act like, oh, yeah, guys, I don't do it for the money. If any YouTuber says that to you, yeah, they're lying, yeah? Remember that. I know I've probably said it at the start of the video because I record the intros after, so I don't know what I'm going to say, but I just want to say as well that the growth on the channel recently has actually been insane, man. Like, we hit 8K the other day. Literally, last video, I was saying, oh, I want to hit it by the end of the month. Like, like well, what is going on, man? At this rate, we're going to be at 10K by the end of the year. Okay, we're running a little bit low on ammo. We should be okay, though. We've got two more rounds to go. And there we go. That is round 17 done. We probably are going to get another Panzer. Do we need to be, like, saving our 96 bullets for that? We probably might get a dog round as well. I've said probably might in this video, like, too many times. No, nope, no dog round for us. Okay. Oh, that is a Panzer, though. All right, hang on. Let's see if it still, like, messes them up. Oh my god, yeah. Oh my god, bro. It took 50 bullets, if that. And a max ammo, bro. Game loves us. See, this is just why BO3 was just the infinitely better COD. Oh, got jump scared by a zombie there. How's our shield doing? Not too bad. Insta kill. Perfect again. If you're wondering why I pull out the MR6 when I'm um, getting insta kill drops, by the way, it just makes the melee and faster. I'm not actually shooting it. I know the sources literally trust me, bro, but I'm not. I promise. And I think that's round 18. Yes, it is. Okay, round 19. The grand finale for Dorizen Drac. I really thought it was going to be a dog round there. Would have been so perfect, but no. Oh, hang on, we're cornered here. No, we're not. Blast when I save my ass. Come on, we're just about done. Please, just give me it. Oh, that nuke could end everything. Oh, I could end everything. Oh my god, there we go. Right, round 20. That is the rising track done. That was a really good and chilled out game of DE for a one box challenge. I don't have high hopes for ZNS. That could go like a million different ways. Anyway, on to ZNS. Right, okay. The second DLC of Black Ops 3, Zetsubo no Shima. And my mouse is moving on its own. Have I been ratted? Nope, it just turns out I dropped my PS4 control. Controller that's plugged in on the floor. Anyway, let's get this started then. Now kick us off with the shopping free. Come on, you know you want to? Yes, let's go. All right, okay. This open. I don't know what side the box is on, but we're just gonna get every place we can open that's possible. Box is just here. That's great. That open. We're down here. We'll also get the green water open so we can get the generator on at some point. I'll run and pass. Grab the shield piece. Go through here. This door open. Also quickly get this one open. Yep, nice. And then our last one here. Yeah, there we go. We got the whole map open. All right, let's get the bunker open. All right, let's get the blue water first. First generator. Clearing out the round as well simultaneously. Bro, we're just on it with this map. We also need to quickly run and grab the green water from down here. Go. Oh, we didn't get this door open. I'm, I'm so stupid, man. All right, okay, get that on. All right, we only have an MR6, and we're going to be going up against the Thrasher here, so... Oh, we killed him before he even converted. Oh, nice. Let's get these cobwebs off here. Let's get this round ended. We can also go back and hit the box. Before we do that, though, I am going to go grab a shield piece. Oh, the round stingers on this map, man. Hands down have to be some of the best, like, music Treyarchs ever orchestrated. Right, okay, here's the mystery box. Please don't be bad. Please be decent. Marshall 16s, come on. High hopes, high hopes. The... <laughs> Oh, I was not expecting that. The ray gun, okay. That works out. Bro, our RNG's been amazing. Right, we need to work on getting the power on, though. And also, let's not kill ourselves this time with the ray gun blast when we're trying to get the uh, air. You know what I'm talking about if you've watched my recent videos, bro. The no perk challenge had me wild and way is quick revive. Come on, where's this last zombie? Is that, is that him? No, okay, got one more. It's never that simple, is it? Got another seed, though. Come on, where is he at, man? There he is. There we go, that's round. Oh, no, one of our generators went off. I think I'd cry if you had to keep them on to get the main switch on. Right, there's the power room. It's 12.50. Okay, it's fine. We also need to look into getting pack up on open, which, you know, is a little bit of a quest in this map because you've got to get the three pieces, but I know where they are. Insane pull from the game, though. Raygon Mark 1. Right, okay, let's go get the power on. Get rid of these webs. 
go. Bro, shooting the ray gun underwater is so weird. It, like, barely moves. It looks like you got no recoil. Oh, it makes it so much easier, though, man. Right, there we go. Holy fucking shit, don't kill me. Let me up, bro. I was drowning there. I don't know why. Main power switch on. Right, we have our first pack a punch piece. We'll put that on there. The only problem I have with the ray gun is that it takes ages to build points. I spin the gobble gun machine here. There's that. There's a dead nuclear window. That's probably going to come in quite helpful, actually. Max ammo. Okay, right, I'm going to waste all the ammo I can. Okay, I can't find any more zombies. Just going to pick it up. Oh, now you start sprinting at me. No bed. Let's get this door open because this is the one that has the shield piece behind it, if I'm not mistaken. There it is. You know, I've never noticed that's just the origin shield, but like all battered with uh, vines and stuff on it. I'm going to go build this at uh, the B laboratory here. Was this A? I don't know. No, this is A, isn't it? Is there even a buildable table here? Yeah, there is. There we go. I reckon we got this one in the bag, honestly. The only thing I'm a little bit worried about is that I haven't seen Quick Revive yet. We also need to save it for Jug. Carpenter, I do not want that. Oh, there's Quick Revive. There we go. Come on, there we go. Round six. I think all of these doors are 1250, if I'm not wrong. Yeah, they are. Bro, that reminds me so much of Mob of the Dead. I've got no idea why. I honestly have a feeling this might be the best pull we get unless we pull the Mark 3s on GK, which, you know what it is? I wouldn't even put it past me. Every time I play GK, I either get it first or second box, box it. So let's just hope it's first today, yeah? All right, let's grab ourselves some Juggernaug. Right, now I feel much safer. We're definitely focus on getting pack a bunch of that's another max ammo we'll go down into the mines first and then we'll go to the spider room to get the other piece and speaking of spiders honestly right i have like a pretty not a fear of spiders but it's like the noises they make and shit these don't scare me and i don't know why they just they look they look kind of cute bro the max ammo bro we got too much ammo that's gonna come back to bite me in the ass no you are not converting low bro no oh he, did he actually convert no he's good i hate that bro the spores just randomly burst sometimes honestly this whole it seems pretty good for spawns. Right, okay, let's get this main room open here. 1250 again. Yep, this is where we need to be for the Pack-A-Bunch piece. Luckily for us, we don't need to go all the way down and grab the KT4 piece. Where is it? Where is Mr. Handle? There it is. Nice. No, 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 no. Don't become a thrasher underwater. God's sake. We got that. Now we just need the third one, which is in the opposite room. Makes sense that you can shoot the ray gun underwater, honestly. You know, with the amount of, like, holes in the front of the gun when you literally reload it. You know what I mean? Saying that, I probably would be complaining like a little whiny muppet if I couldn't, so... Okay, round 10. Halfway there already. Definitely feel like we're about to get shafted with our luck soon, though. Let's stick this handle on here. All right, we just need one more. It's three here. Oh, that's a thrasher. Hello. Uh, do you want to die? I literally have a ray gun in my hand. What is going on, bro? Bro, he regened. Oh, it's just there's a spore there. That's a thing. There's a drop there. I don't know what it is. That's a death machine. Bro, there is two thrashers. Bro, he's draining my ammo. So many spored zombies, man. Please, none of you mutate. Okay, well, that was round anyway. I'm trying to look for my pack a bunch piece, bro. Leave me alone. Oh, it's there. Nice. And chuck that on there. And that is pack a bunch open. Right, we should probably start saving up for it anyway, because the ray gun does drop off quite fast, especially in BO3. It's not making crawlers just yet, though, I don't think. Oh, God, no, please don't kill me. Okay, we are running really low on ammo. I'm going to try to get as many points as I can, grab that nuke, and then probably pop the other ones and go pack a bunch. All right, never mind. We don't even need it. Right, hang on. Wait, wait, wait. We might get spider around. Just double check. Oh, I'm so smart, bro. I'm so unbelievably smart. I can count. That proves I'm smart, bro. Come on. There we go. And there's the max ammo. I want to refrain from using pack a bunch as much as possible if necessary because yes it gives you higher damage yes it gives you bullet boost but like ammo is key here if we like waste all the ones that we have now i just feel like we're putting the run at risk you know what i mean i'm acting as if i'm going for like some sort of world record here man okay it's starting to make crawlers now i think maybe round 15 will give it a little pack up on treatment i can't believe trey i've tried to sell models of this for 250 quid when i've got it in game for free bro money saving genius over here come on shoot this is last yep okay right i'm gonna go pack a bunch it now i think i've never seen it with this camo on before that looks gross, but also kind of cool at the same time. I think that's a Thrasher spawning again. Okay, it's one shot again. I'm happy. Yeah, that is a Thrasher. Bro, they actually soak the bullets of the ray gun. Ridiculous. Oh, you regen. How do they regen? Do they just eat zombies? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, he's dead. There's another one, man. I've never understood how, like, these things spawn. I know it's to do with the spores, but, like, I've never really fully understood how to get them to mutate. I'm gonna grab this nuke. Should have probably crafted the gas mask at this point, but whatever. Okay, and that is round. Okay, even now it's starting to make crawlers again. It really, it lasted for one round. That's kind of disappointing. I can't believe how bad the ray gun is, like, post BO1. Like, even in BO2, that stuff was lacking, bro. I don't know why, but on DE, it always goes so fast and on ZNS it always feels so slow. I think it's because ZNS's colour palette is just like grey and green. DE saturated. It gives my brain dopamine. Come on, where's the last zombie at? Okay, that is round again. Okay, wait, this might be the only camera where you can actually see the... You can see the ray gun bullets. That's kind of cool. Okay, yeah, they are full on sprinting now. Got a death machine here. Yeah, I might as well use it for a little bit. Oh, max ammo. Never mind. I'll use a little bit more of a ray gun. Gonna have to reload quick. Hurry up. There we go. Right, we're 
chilling for ammo, bro. Be round? Question mark? No, there's still one more kicking about somewhere. Oh, there they are. Bro, why does it do this? There we go. That's round. Ooh, nice little round skip as well. Okay. Nice to know my Raygun still one shots the spiders. And there we go. That was probably the fastest spider run I've ever had. I swear the spawns must be like stupid fast around here. Another Thrasher. Go away. You're like the worst mini boss in all of BO3, and that is saying something. Oh, God. Conveniently placed death machine is convenient. There we go. Another one, bro. You don't stand a chance. Okay, we're actually having to start the train. Fine, though. I think we're, like, pretty much near the end of round 18 now. Kind of. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know if they're still spawning. Insta-kill, anyway? Yep, there we go. Right, one more round to go. Try and knife as many as I can, because, you know, it's insta-kill. Another max ammo, bro. I'm just gonna pick this straight up. Didn't even tell my teammates to reload, bro. I ain't got time. Try and kill as many as I can before I pick that up. It's not gonna end the round by any means, because round 19's probably split up into multiple hordes, but... Right, okay. No, that did not end the round. And that is round 20. Okay, we're done. On to GK. And the third DLC of BO3, Gorod Krovi. Okay, right, let's spin a gobblegum machine here. Come on, shot them free. Oh, right, I'm not grabbing the Perkaholic. We're not that low. I know I grabbed it for Shadows of Evil, but, you know, I needed the benefit of the doubt. That map is way too massive to be running around grabbing perks on for a one-box challenge video. Saying that, like, GK isn't. But, yeah, well, one more official BO3 want to go, then it's all of Zombies Chronicles. Kind of excited to hop on the older maps, see how they play with it, because although, yes, it's BO3 weapons, there's some maps that don't have Pack-A-Bunch machines, like Verruckt, and stuff. So that could go south pretty quick. Right, a couple of things we need to do. We need to build a shield, and we also need to get Hacker Punch online. And that's a mix of RNG and skill on this map, so... Come on, shot them free. Nah, no, man. Around Robin, it's getting used. Oh, come on, man. That's literally... Oh, that's all of them but shot them free. Ridiculous. Right, one more. Yeah, there we go. Right, okay. We've got to hit the box with this, because we only got 100 points. Right, let's head up these stairs. Get that door open as well. I need to work out what side the mystery box is on, and we need to quickly hit it, then run. It's that side. Okay, I want to get at least one route to power open, though. Quickly turn power on, then run back. Right, okay. Right, juice me up. Come on. Get this door open as well. What do we get? Oh, no, bro. Oh, I don't think we're surviving long on GK, boys. Right, okay. Let's start work on the shield. I'm pretty sure we can get two of the pieces. Insane Gaming Viper. Thank you for subscribing, bro. There's the first bit, and then the other one's over the bridge, but I don't have enough of the bridge because I'm poor. Yeah, it's not looking good, bro. I'm sitting round seven out of push. I actually can't believe it happened. I really was going to, like, I thought we were just going to have really good RNG for all these runs, but no, we got the shield. Shiva. Cheers, game. Where is the shield be beat? Shield piece at? Oh, it's there. There we go, right? We're just missing the little middle bit, which I'm pretty sure we can get without opening them other two doors. If we just head down here, through here, is it on the chair? Yes, it is. Okay, cool. Oh, I'm not feeling good about this one. Right, let's just get the shield built. Maybe that'll be coming useful. We we'll get one of these doors open as well. Might as well. Right, I'm going to keep a killjoy on deck. We kind of need this. I'm not going to lie. If we want to try to get around 20, I am genuinely saying like round 10 out of push. To be fair, it's still getting some headshot kills if you get a couple in the dome, but that's going to drop off real fast. See, we're already on 17 bullets, bro. It's actually so over. And where's my network conduit? Ah, I should have it by now. We need Pack-A-Punch ASAP. Come on, why don't you just drop it, please? Ah, uh, we need to go run and grab ammo, and it's all the way in spawn. Definitely going to be using a lot of the shield this game. I can already sense it. Might be a wise idea to actually stay near spawn. Where actually is the Shiva? There's the RK5. Is it in here? No. Oh, there's the Shiva. Okay. At least it's got fast mags. We can grab Juggernog in a bit as well. Double tap 2 is definitely going to be a necessity as well. Oh, there we go. Finally, first craft module. Oh, this might be a little bit of a doozy as well, because the gun like literally fires two rounds a year. you got to defend these. Oh, we'll give it a go. We've got some killjoys. We should be able to get through it. Slap this in here. Okay, yeah, we really need Jug as well. Where is this craft module gone? That is that spawn, I think. Oh, no, it's right here. That's not spawn. Okay. This is this is manageable. Not too bad. If I can hit my shots. Okay, there's a few of them now. All right, Nuke, perfect. All right, okay, with the help of Nuke, with the help of Nuke, with the help of a Nuke, we got the first one pretty painless. I am going to run and grab Jug real quick. There we go. All right, we're doing all right. We're doing all right. Okay, yeah, it's definitely taking a few now. Oh, we got the supply depot cylinder. I need to run and grab some ammo first, though, before we do anything. Oh, my God, no, not yet. Not yet. Can't be there. Bro, no, 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 no. No chance. Oh, max ammo. Perfect. Right, let's go do supply depot. Chuck that in there. Bro, that insta kill. Oh, never mind. We got another one. I was going to say that insta kill ran out of the worst time possible. Where is this rough module? Oh, it's over there. Oh, God, it's getting attacked. Go away, man. I can't believe we've got to do this entire game with a Shiva. I'm going to complain about this throughout the entire fucking GK bit. Bro, it's gone yellow. No. You will never take my Groff module. All right, network circuit. Nice. Right, we just need one more, and then we can go get this thing packed. We somehow managed to whack an A80 on this. I reckon it's doable. Oh, my God. Hang on. Tank factory. Perfect, bro. We need more ammo. No, 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 no. See, I can't like, push 
just pass zombies like I usually come with any other weapon. Okay, I'm up, I'm up. Let's call this in. All right, looks like it's over here. Is it here again? Surely not, right? No, it's not. Where's that? All right, I'm gonna pop a killjoy here. Just try and make this, you know, doable. Oh, nuke. I like how a nuke still counts to zombies. It's brilliant. All right, there we go. All three network circuits, bro. We're getting away from places. We actually are. We really need ammo, though, so I'm gonna go quickly run down and grab some. While we're here, though, stick them in there. Grab some ammo off the wall. Now we just gotta kind of build points. Pack a punch is 5k. All right, another cylinder. Why would I need that? Like I was saying, no, pack a punch is 5k, and to get an AAT, that's another 2.5 on top. This is gonna be a bit of a struggle. We're making a fair few points, to be fair. Oh, double points. The game's just trying to bless me up. Oh, my God, insta kill. The stop are actually aligning. Right, let's go run to the nearest dragon and then we'll go pack a punch this and actually get an AAT on it. If we get turned, I think I'll cry on camera. Mr. Dragon, get your ass over here. Somehow, someway, we've done it. We've unlocked pack a punch. Nothing but a Shiva. Right, okay. AAT, don't fail me now. It's called the Cumulus Struggle, bro. We'll be getting Thunderwall. Okay, well, that's something, I guess. It's not something good. It's something, though. Oh, 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 one shot headshot? Really? Oh, it's a mangler. You know what? I'm not going to deal with him today. Okay, this is actually usable now. What? Okay, maybe it's not over. You also get loads more ammo. Okay, 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 okay. Maybe I've slept on the Shiva this entire time. Saying that, it, only, it is only round nine going round ten, so I'm being optimistic at best. Valkyrie rounds are going to be fun. And we're back. And I just had a mangler spawn in again. Okay, yeah, this is a lot more usable than it was unpacked. But still, we've got to build points and stuff because ammo for it's going to be 4,500 now. Yeah, can you go away? Cheers. Oh, what? Bro, who, bro, who thought it was a good idea to bring back the transit fire zombies? Who, who is it? A Treyarch, bro? I want to know. I want their name. Right, round 11. Nine more to go. We Oh, I don't know if we've got this, you know. I'm actually a little bit scared. Okay, Valkyries. Not good. Not good. Not good. I am going to go get double tap two because I'm smart. It doubles my damage, bro. Grab this. Okay, this thing's kind of like fully auto now, but oh my god, does this take a lot of shots to kill these? Jesus, that's like, what, 15 shots for one Valkyrie? There we go, there we go. We're getting through it, we're getting through it. Just about used pretty much all of our ammo on that, man. Right, thank you very much. Nice little round skip as well. Okay, round 12. Eight more to go. Uh, I think I think we should have this, hopefully. Death Machine. I feel like I'll be cheating to pick that up. If I do manage to get round 20, you have to keep watching, bro. To be fair, it's headshot multiplier is not bad. It's actually like going through a couple of them as well. It's not just stopping. If you click fast enough as well, it's almost full auto. Like, look at this. It's not terrible. It's about like the Gorgon speed. Right, okay. Still got a decent amount of ammo. It's round 13. We've got enough points for another clip if we need it. We're chilling, we're chilling, we're chilling. Okay, things are starting to pick up a little bit now. Use a shield blast. Bro, how did my man over there get affected by the shield, but not the literal ones in front of me? Right, okay, that's another round down, bro. Come on, round 20. We've so got it. I am going to go grab some ammo, though, because we're running quite low. But it lasted a little while, to be fair. There's our ammo. Very nice. Let's head back to Dragon Command. My safe space. I feel like I'm going to get overrun here. Don't know why. I'm surprised we've got this far, honestly. Why did my mouse just drop its DPI? What was that about? We're sniping them, kind of, if I could hit my shots. I'm going to use this last shield blast since it's about a break. The shield blast on, like, the god of, uh, was it Fan Fear? Fan, whatever, I don't know. It's actually really good, though. What is the shield actually called? The god of the god of Fafnir. Okay. Okay. Five more rounds. We got this. We got this. We got this. Why am I keep getting fuck off with the carpenters, man? Okay, that's a mangler. We got a shot in the shield. Oh, that's two manglers. Okay, we don't have two shots. Insta kill. Perfect timing. And the max ammo even better. How does it face against the mangler? Bro, it actually destroyed them. Double points. Okay, maybe the Shiva's not that bad. Bro, that just one shot at him. What? Maybe he's affected by insta kill. There's no way it's that good. Right, we need another shield. Because that was coming in clutch when we were, like, getting stuck in situations. Okay, grab a shield. That's a nuke. Okay, we could take advantage of that, maybe. It's round 16, though, to be fair. Try to kill as many as I can. Just hard considering my only weapon is a Shiva with Thunderwall. Oh, no. This is why we grabbed the shield. Oh, we completed a trial. I kind of forgot those existed on GK. Oh, fire zombies. Oh, my God. Bro, go away. Come on, surely we're nearly done now. Yes, that's round. Okay, right. Three more, three more, three more. Another mangler spawning in, man. Okay, yeah, no, he was definitely not affected. It was all insta-kill. Use that. Just trying to use everything I have available to me to try and, like, give myself the best odds. Oh, they're spawning in Valkyries now as well. Okay, gone. Oh, oh ammo's about to be gone too, though. That is a max ammo and a death machine. I'm using this. I don't care. Insta-kill. Right, I'm putting death machine away now. Is that last? No way.
Hey, bro. Oh, oh, my God, bro. Round 20 with the Shiva. Actually insane. Honestly, I was memeing on Thunderwall, but, like, it's been doing pretty good. It's been keeping them out of the way. And it's still headshotting them. Another double point? Sure. Sure. I would be lying to you, though, if I didn't say I was, like, kind of focused on their heads, though. And my commentary has probably been a little bit off here because I've just been so hyper-focused on getting headshots. Oh, God. Oh, that's a lot of them. That is a lot of them. No way. It's keeping it back, bro. Use this. And again. Oh, we're nearly there, man. Come on. Nuke, nuke. That should end the round, hopefully. Yes! Right, round 19. One more, one more, one more. We got this. We got this. I don't know what's worse. This or the XM50? Definitely XM53. There's no PhD in this game. We'd be fucked. Oh, it's a Valkyrie round as well. Perfect. It's gonna soak up all my bullets. Okay, that was 25 bullets to kill one. Okay. Come on, just die. Oh, it's electric zombies now. What? Oh my god, there's so many electric zombies. Since when did they spawn in? I am going to die. No, not this close. Not this close. No, 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 no. That's not how this works. Oh, with the MR6. Come on, finish him off. Oh, we've run out of ammo, man. Do we have our shield? We do. Are we done? Yes, we're done. There's the max ammo. Let's go. Oh, bro. Round 20 with the Shiva only and a little bit of Mega Gobblegums. But we only use a shot and free and an insta kill Gobblegum. That was boss from us, to be fair. All right, revelations. Right, okay. The last of the BO3 maps. Well, the official ones, at least. Revelations. And what is this? That's a round robin. Okay, I am taking it for the sake that this map is massive. And I just want to get over to the box. Where is the box? It's an Origins. Okay. Okay, it's an, I don't know what this is. Killjoy. I don't want that. Oh, perfect, man. Shop it free. Let's go. Let's go. With Origins. Why was that so delayed? Oh, my God. Shield piece. Right, okay. I am going to hit the box now. What we getting? What we getting? Please don't be the XM53 again. Please. The Dracon. That is so much better. For the record, by the way, I'm recording these all out of order. Because, you know, I don't really want to the same order over and over again. It kind of drives me stir crazy. Whatever map I played last, bro, I got the XM53. It was stressful. Can we get a bit of a rucked open here? Hang on. Nah, I don't think so. I don't think so. <sighs> Is that enough to get us outside? No. Ah, oh, it's a shame. Oh, wait, no, that is enough to get us outside. Let's go. Right, let's get this conversion generator started. Yeah, the Dracon is definitely a good pick for this. We're really just going to be hanging about spawn anyway, so... I think without the ELO site, I would have been a little bit annoyed, but hey, honestly, this is fine. Max ammo already, bro. Right, let's quickly jump back over to the Origins mob part, just so we can get this other generator on here. There's that uh, summoning altar thing. I don't know why I picked that up like we're going to build it, but, you know, get this on. Sooner we get Pack-A-Punch on, the better. Right, and I think that's the... The only two generators we can do for now because the other two are over in the Shang and DE and Kino area and we don't have the current point budget to open them doors. So let's head back the way through and just sit and spawn for a little bit. Oh, I didn't get that one on. Oh, we're only missing one. Okay, right. Okay. Let's head back through, go through the origins way, get the one at the house on. Why didn't I do that? Grab Al's cap. I swear after this map, a DLC 5 was just, like, inbound. I don't even think it was a second thought from Treyarch. Like, when they when they were, like, remastering little bits of the maps, I'm sure they were like, bro, we, we've, got, we've got to drop Zombies Chronicles. Like, come on. The whole community was feeling it, to be fair, as well, at the time, anyway. Okay, that's that done. Got one more to do. Try to get as many points as I can before I pick that nuke up, though. Okay. Right, we should have enough to get through the DE area. Like I've said, and I'll say it again, I don't know why they threw DE in here. That door is very cool. But like I said, I don't know, I don't know why they threw DE in here. It was so early for it to be, like, I don't know, incorporated into a map where it's made to be like old maps. I, I don't know. They could have stuck like buried or something here, man. Okay, that was fast. An insta kill. I will happily take that. Oh my god, no, 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 no. I am not dying. That's what I mean by when situations get dire. For the starting pistol, anyway. Okay, that's the last one. Right, let's head back through. I'm gonna grab Jug. We're gonna open Pack a Punch. Then we're gonna chill. This open. Drink this. Is he flying by? No. We can wait here then. We're doing okay for ammo. Could be a little bit better, but what can you do? Right, okay, fire that. This ELO site is definitely helping. Right, I think we should focus on pack a punch next just because i want to guarantee our guns like actual use case safety rather than just being a paperweight and like me begging for a max ammo carpenter i don't really want to pick that up the amount of carpenters we've got this run is actually insane not on this map just this video in general bro i feel like i've seen like two max ammos and like 50 carpenters right so back to the house because i think the spawns are quite fast there even though it is only round six i'm pretty sure there's like six windows here oh it's bees anyway it's a max ammo round let's go but yeah no there's like there's one two three there's one in a four five six there's a couple there's a couple here yeah this is definitely the gun for taking out the bees like bro how many want to spawn i haven't got that much ammo there we go all right thank you very much i'm also gonna grab quick revive because i don't want this to be a one hit done double points that's kind of perfect bro that's another carpenter bro who's got my xid who's messing with my game okay this round should nearly be over i think it's only round seven there's another window here as well more zombies more yes all right we're gonna go to the apothecary now to get our gun packed all right let's go shoot down the heart uh 
I've already shot one. There's another one. And there's another one. But, oh, I was where did the pack of machine go? Put that in there. Grab that. And I am... Oh, which, which way am I going? Let's go this way. I suppose it doesn't really matter. We're going back to the house anyway. Bro, the Pack-A-Punch camo on this looks so good. And that is another max ammo. Bro, a sneeze almost just got me killed. Okay, round nine. Doing well. Almost halfway there. 12 minutes in. Oh, the skybox, man, is so nice. Like, even by today's standards, that's still amazing. I don't think we've actually had a zombies map that rivals the color scheme of this map. Like, ever. Like, Ancient Evil looked nice, but it, it did not look this nice. Okay, I am going to grab a death machine. Okay, there. Round 10. We are officially halfway there. 10 more rounds before we go to Nocturne and Toten. <laughs> I'm sure that one's going to be a riveting experience. You know, that that map's renowned for its fast spawns. Especially on round 1. Not going to grab that just yet. So glad I put an ELO site on this thing. Oh my god, don't die on insta-kill. Especially not on insta-kill. Jesus. Okay. Should do some damage at least. Didn't end the round. That's fine though. Another double point. Okay, that's round 11. I always found these turrets so pointless. They were just so clearly emphasized to be used for the Easter egg. You can't get off them once you get on them, I don't think. At least that's the issue I have with them. I think my copy of my game is just bugged. Okay, we got about 70 bullets left. Hopefully, we should get like a B round next round. Or maybe a Magua. Another Carpenter. Bro, stop it. Okay, we are running a bit low on ammo now. A little bit worried. I hope this round is some kind of special round. Okay, it is a Magua, but that doesn't mean we're going to get max ammo. All right, it's so a two shot to the uh, skull there. All right, okay, one, two, three. Three, four. Okay, I guess not. Oh, that attack is crazy, bro. Oh, bro. Okay, he's dead. Am I going to get some sort of max ammo, please? I need... Okay, Death Machine, that'll do. Double points. That was not what I was hoping for. I mean, a Death Machine will do for now, but, like, I can't use this permanently. Okay, we ended the round. That's fine. I'm going to try to get a Gumball to help us out here. Not a Perkaholic. I don't want that. Please give me, like, a Killjoy. No, dead a nuclear winter. It's something. Okay, we really need a max ammo, man. I guess let's hold him up and let's pop a nuke. Don't really know what to do here. Okay, right. Pop that. Took out a lot of them, to be fair. It's going to be another Horde, though, because it's, like, a little bit of a high round now. I'm going to pop another one. What is it just spat out. Is that Perkaholic again? I don't want that, bro. Okay, well, that ended the round. Killjoy, please, 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 please. No, not another dead nuclear winter. Right, that should be Killjoy. Jesus, please. No, 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 no. How long am I going to stay red for? What a joke. I'm going to pop this now. Oh, my God. Jesus. Oh, my God, bro. Why rev? Why do I always have issues with rev? All right, on to Nocturne and Toten. Right, okay, the one that's probably going to take the longest, but, you know, is the smallest one. Nocturne and Toten. Good thing is, the box can't move and it's just in there. Not that it would move anyway, but, you know. My only gripe with this map is that it's actually going to take forever because of the spawns. If we get some decent headshots in the early round with the M1911, we might be good, but it is going to take a while. Even on BO3, this map is still slow. What an OG map, though, man. Literally the one that started it all. Do I think it deserved a spot in Zombies Chronicles? Probably not, but, you know, what we got it and i'm not going to complain okay that's the first round done i have a grand total of 11 bullets we just need to get 500 more points so we can open the door and spin the box and hopefully get the thunder gun is that going to happen no see this is what i mean man like where are the zombies oh there's one and we are completely out of ammo okay we're gonna have to rely on the barrels and grenades got a zombie here okay, i think after this guy we're gonna need one more and here he is Right, okay. Let's get the help door open, and what are we getting? Come on, juice me up, juice me up. Come on, come on. The Pharaoh. The, the Pharaoh. Right, okay, whatever. We're, we're not surviving very long, I don't think. Early rounds? Sure, definitely. Later rounds? No. There's no Pack-a-Punch machine on this map. It's so over. Saying that, I have a feeling these guns are just going to get worse from here on out, so make sure to keep watching. Come on, where's this last zombie, man? Nocturne and Totem's great if you've got some friends to play with solo. It's, like, slightly unnerving and just boring, man. Come on, where where is he? There. Is that last? Yes. Yeah, Alright, okay. Round three. We've got a Pharaoh and a Death Wish. I'm saying we'll get about round 10, maybe round 15 if we get a max ammo or two. We're just gonna have to be really careful with bullets, so I think I'm just gonna knife, just for now. It's a good thing I've done all the weapon kits for all my weapons on this game, so it at least has attachments. Now, I don't know if any of them attachments actually affect its damage, but it looks cool. Oh, that's a max ammo. Okay. Right, let's try to find the uh, zombies for this round. There's another one. There's another one. There's another one. Really just want to end this round. Take full advantage of the max ammo. Right, nope. Okay, grab it now. Of course he's on this side. There we go. That's not even last. He was sprinting, bro. It's round three. There we go. Bro, this game's actually making a mug of me. What? Where is the last zombie? Where? 
Come on, man. Yeah, we love Nocturne and Totem on this channel. At least on Varukt and Shinonuma, they actually kind of perfected the spawns. Well, not so much on World of War, but at least on BO3, it's Shinonuma's definitely, like, leagues better than this. Where is he? Is that him? There we go. Right, okay, round four. At least we'll get one sprinter. Okay, they're picking up the pace slightly. Not by much, though. Still, though, it's, a little, uh, it's appreciated, you know what I mean? Okay, we are already nearly on two clips. This is not going great. That's an insta-kill, though. Like I said before, I really don't want to buy perks because, you know, I feel like it's not even Nocturne and Totem if you're allowed the whole arsenal of perks so i guess we're adding an extra layer of challenge but it just makes the video more interesting to be fair and oh my god there we go round five we're one quarter of the way there we're gonna see another five and then i'll be it but you know jesus man right we need a max ammo like now i cannot believe we pulled the pharaoh out of everything man it's gonna try and wait for them to actually come into the map so we have the best chance of getting max ammos see the most annoying thing about this weapon is that it's burst fire and you can't even like drag it over because it only bursts for so long come on one of you just drop a max ammo i know i've just had one but please oh god we're out of ammo already. Carpenter, man. I'm really reduced to my knife already. This run is not going to go well. We're making loads of points, though. Let me just double check that there's no feral war by up here, yeah? Oh! Bro, I didn't even know this existed. All oh, right, the stars are aligned. We're chilling. But what are the odds of that? The Pharaoh only became a wall by, I think, like once uh, Zombies Chronicle released. Zombies Chronicle. I mean, Zombies Chronicles. I think it was like only a wall by in those maps. I might be chatting up my ass, though. I do not remember that being there. All right, okay, that fills me with a lot more confidence. Maybe round 20 can actually happen. Okay, they're starting to come through here now. Okay, things are picking up a little bit. This is good. This is good. Nuke, that might actually end the round. I hope it does. Oh, you're telling me that didn't end the round, bro? Now we gotta wait like nine light years for this zombie to actually make his way over to the map because he's probably a stumbler oh no okay right he's got some pace to him oh he's got some pace to him look at him go right okay round seven man i have had such a long day today been in college till five oh bro like and recording like don't get me wrong i love doing youtube but like man am i tired definitely gonna be trying to get as many videos as i can out though for you guys because you know there's a lot of you now and i don't say enough on the channel how much that actually means to me so once again thank you to be fair the pharaoh is still eating through them not fast but still killing them need some ammo though i am so glad this war buys here man come on where's the last zombie at there we go right i'm not picking up that cop now because it's gonna slow us down even more i'm gonna get this barrier open and try to speed things up a little bit just so they can like actually run up here and then down i'm gonna start eating my words once it gets pa past round 15 but for now bro i'm just trying to get onto the rook as fast as i can okay yeah it's starting to drop off a little bit now we're running through ammo like really fast pack a punch would be great but unfortunately we don't have that available to us okay it's the kill it's nice come on oh Right, that should probably end the round. I'd hope so. Yep, yeah, there we go. Right, round nine. We're nearly there. 11 more to go. Okay, yeah, they are starting to pour in now. That is, like, actually pretty much a horde. And this pharaoh has dropped off, bro. It's like a matter of three rounds. And it's not even high rounds either. Julie, we must be close to the end of the round now. Double points. I can literally spend them on just about nothing. Apart from ammo. And that should be last. Okay, halfway there. Round 10. Let's go. Having just a pharaoh, we're doing really well. It is taking a few bursts now, though, to take one down. Oh, my God. That's a few of them. Oh, we're out of ammo. Oh, shoot. Okay, that was ridiculous. <gasps> okay, let's not die. Cheers for the max ammo. It's a bit late now. And the double points, bro. That's like probably two of the most useless drops we could have got there. Like, the max ammo is appreciated, but like, oh, that is an insta kill. Lob a grenade. And that's round. Round 11. Do you think we get the round five until I saw that war buy? And we're completely out again, bro. Oh, this is not looking. Like, I was chilling with the war buy, infinite ammo, you know, stuff like that. But damage is just not holding up, man. Oh, God. No, not like this. Not like this. Not like this. Not like this. Not like. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, that sucks. Anyway, on to Verrucked. Right, okay. Verrucked. Now, I'm telling you now, if we don't get some sort of, like, automatic bullet weapon, I'm gonna be so annoyed. But this is what I mean, bro. The spawns, so much faster. It's great. And then, at least in World at War, on Shino Numa, they were like, nah, go back to slow. We actually have a couple of doors to open here to get the power in the box, so we need to be careful with our ammo. I say that as I have a grand total of seven bullets left, and it's only round two. Right, okay, we really need to be careful here. Oh, max ammo, never mind. Right, okay, we're chilling for a while at least, and the double points, bro, and the zombies, this is insane. Revolutionary. And an insta kill. Oh my god. Alright, let's take a full advantage of this. Let's rebuild some barriers, bro. Oh, can we get another kill in before it ends? We can. What about here? Yes, we can. Right, okay. Let's get moving. Is the box in the power room? I think it always spawns in the power room first. Yeah, I think it is. This open. And this one. And then, please juice me up. Please. Like PPSH or something, please. The Cuda. Okay, I did ask for a fully automatic weapon, and that was all. So I can't be complaining. Right, we're keeping that door shut, and we're just going to stick to one side of the map. Now, luckily for us, Jug, Quick Revive, the whole shebang are on this map, meaning that we actually might stand a bit of a chance here. The only thing that isn't included 
it is pack a punch. But that's okay. Right, let's go quick revive. Double tap two is definitely going to be a lifesaver with this. Come on, where's the last zombie at? There he is, and he had a nuke on him. Wait, what? Bro, I got a nuke and it didn't end the round. What? What is bro doing? There we go. He, he should be the last one. Yeah, right, okay. Round four, let's go. Very happy with the Kuda, honestly. Not the highest amount of ammo, but I'm pretty sure it should be a wall buy somewhere. I'd be very surprised if it wasn't, honestly. I think it originally used to be there, but they replaced it with the MP40. Once that little patch came out for Zombies Chronicles. Through here? No. No, I see car 9. It might be up here. It's the Vespa. Can't seem to find it anywhere. Need to be really careful with this map because, you know, even with the BO33 hit system or the 5 hit system with Jug, it's still so close quarters. Is it up here? I'm gonna have a quick gander around. It might be like in here somewhere. Nope, that is the HVK. No way the Kuda's not on this map. I actually refuse to believe. Bootleggers in there. But we have nine bullets. This is not good. Carpenter. It's not really what I wanted though. There it is. I knew it would be on here. I, I was gonna say I refuse to believe. Okay, we need to grab Jug soon-ish because they're gonna start sprinting soon and when they start sprinting, I get scared. <laughs> right, let's go grab Jug. There we go and I am chilling. Right, okay, that's the end of the round. Nice. It's also nice to know that we have the wall by over here. Kind of similar to the Pharaoh. If we keep getting wall weapons, bro, is this really the one box challenge? But, ah, bro, 630 for ammo is insane. Still gonna buy it, though. Got death machine here. And again, what? I just put it away. Things are starting to pick up slightly. Not too much, but just enough to notice. Come on, bro. This has got to be surely close to the end of the round, at least. We'll grab double tap two. That's basically the equivalent of pack a punch. Kind of. Grab some more ammo. And that is round. Okay, round seven. Do you know what it is? As much as I love Zombies Chronicles, and like the whole map pack idea and stuff like the eight classic remastered maps it's a it's a really cool idea the world of war maps did not deserve to be remastered man like that might be a hot take but I, you could have filled that in with so many better options die rise buried literally anything else I understand time, but then there's also, like, being a little bit lazy? I don't know. I might be being a bit greedy since we did get, like, you know, three of the BO1 and BO2 classic maps remastered, but I feel like you could have just squeezed, like, Buried or maybe even Die Rise in there instead of something like Verrucked. I, I don't know, man. Or even Knacked. More ammo. Yeah, the thing is definitely killing a lot better with Double Tap. We might just see through to the end of this. God, Shido Numa doesn't have a pack of punch machine either, bro. Gonna have to get some more good RNG, hopefully. What was that? I just dropped. I heard a drop behind me. Max ammo. Probably should have put on something like Armamental. Not Armamental. What's it called? Alchemical? No, is it is that Alchemical Antithesis? No, that's the fire sale one, right? Bro, I'm actually getting, like, Alzheimer's. What's going on? No, Immolation's the fire sale one. I was right, Alchemical. I probably should have put something like that on to, like, you know, just pack a punch the gun. Or even, like, a wall power. Or crate power, sorry. Okay, round nine. You know, as much as I want to, like, actually complete this challenge, I really hope they don't spot spot stoning. I swear with every video I make, my words just get worse. Like, I'm gradually, like, losing my reading age with every video I make. It's probably because of how many times I've played through the BO3 maps. Losing brain cells at this point. Or, you know, maybe it's because, like, I've gone two hours of sleep nearly every day, but, you know, it's fine. I can't lie, sometimes when I'm in college, man, I feel like I've got brain rot. They do say if you don't sleep, your brain technically eats itself. So I've probably got, like, half a brain stem left at this point. That's probably how I've still got, like, the usual functions, like, living, breathing, eating, making YouTube videos, all that stuff that forms in the brainstem, yeah? Some more ammo. Right, round 10, halfway there. Let's hope this goes a little bit better than Knacked, because that was embarrassing for me. I mean, to be fair, we had a Pharaoh. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Chill out, bro, it's round 10. Not round 100. Oh god, I need more ammo. I don't want to pick that carpenter up. Go. Come on, surely that's it. There we go. Round 11. We're on par with Knacked right now. Let's beat it. Oh no, not the carpenter, bro. I actually need someone. Right, honestly, if you've watched this far through the video, one of you guys, I want you to go through and see how many carpenters I've actually picked up. And if you post it in the comments, I'll pin and heart it. Because this is ridiculous. I actually need someone to go and count. Right, okay, that's round. Round 12. That was quite fast, actually, to be fair. It is taking a few bullets to kill them. If you aim for the head, though, their heads just pop off. But it's just like when the recoil goes a little bit above, you got to come back down. You end up hitting the body, and it's just not good. Camjo01, thank you for subscribing. Okay, we need more ammo. Oh, God, no. Bro, what? Do not tell me we're beating knocked by one round. I would be so annoyed. Right, we need to run and grab quick revive. We're just going to grab this nuke. Double tap. And that is round, actually. Grab jug. And grab quick revive. But all the perks on this map are so close together. It's kind of ridiculous. Right. We are, like, running through ammo each time. Hence why I'm just staying next to the wall by. Since I don't want to make it too hard on ourselves. That is a death machine. Fast mags basically make speed cooler, like, useless. Some more ammo. And that is round. Okay, yeah. They, they sped up quite fast now. Right. Round 14. Six more to go. I think this might be the first time I ever complete a challenge on Verrucked. Every Every time we get up to this map, I feel like I just die. Then again, we're still six rounds off, but it's nice to be optimistic. Max ammo, double points. I don't really need that. Okay, I'm going to grab some ammo, then peel around the corner. Really need to just aim for their head as hard as I can, man. Oh, 
okay, let's not die. Okay, I'm using the death machine here. It's only fair. Oh my god, no, 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 not to one zombie. That's not happening. All right, okay, that is round. Five more to go. I, I feel like we got this in the bag, bro. Come on. You know, I feel like we got this in the bag just after we almost went down again to one single zombie. Might they add with one arm? There's nothing wrong with having one arm. Just be a bit embarrassing to have a full submachine gun in my hands and I get decked by a zombie who has no brain and no arm. Bro, I'm really getting into this now. I'm sorry. Bro, how many drops? Okay, 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 okay. Because of a rock's nature, all the spawns just start piling in. Right, I'm gonna grab this nuke. It might end the round. It might not. I'm not too sure. It did. Okay, round 16. Nice. Four more to go. Got an insta-kill here. It's always appreciated. Oh my god. Yeah, you know, once the insta-kill wears off, then they all start piling in. Isn't that great? Convinced that's coded in the game, man. Nice little max ammo here. Means I don't have to run to the wall by. God. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Grab some more ammo while we get some downtime here. There we go. Okay. Round 17. Three more to go. Okay, that's a nuke already, man. That's not good. It's just gonna slow us down. I had a drop. Oh, I must be downstairs because I can't find it. Oh my god, there's an actual horde. Oh, oh no. <sighs> right, we're beating this. I don't care. There's a death machine sitting in front of us. We've got another quick revive. We're chilling. We're chilling. Double points. You know, why not? Right, grab jug. Grab quick revive. Right, we don't have double tap anymore. This is going to be a lot more difficult. There goes quick revive because we're really bad. And that is round. Two more, two more. If we don't get this, I'm going to be so mad. They are really grouping up now, though. It's getting really difficult. Because, like, the Kuda's still definitely killing them, just not fast enough. Grab some more ammo quick, not get cornered. I said, let's not get cornered. They're coming from down there. Move. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. No, 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 man. Oh, uh, uh, what do I do? What do I do? Oh, no, no, die, apparently. Okay, our final world at warm up, Shinonuma. And for some reason, quick revives in the spawn room. Uh, don't question it. Don't question it. The people working on Zombies Chronicles were clearly on something else. And like I said, even on BO3, the spawns on here, little bit too long for my liking. You already know how I feel about Nocturne and Totem, so we might... Might as well grab Quick Revive, honestly. Since it's been given to us, at least. And we just basically need to get enough points for the first doors, I think. Box is just downstairs. Oh, and I say this every time we play Shinonuma, but they added the Zettable Round Stinger. It's such a nice nod. Brilliant, man. Okay, we've got just about enough points to open up the first door here. Let me just double check that the box actually is here. Yes, it is. Okay. Now we just need enough points to spin it once. Okay, one more zombie should do it. Yeah, we definitely got enough. I'm just going to end the round real quick. Top of points at the end of the round. It's just how it works. Right, okay. Just me up, please, please, please. I'm close my eyes. Guys, STG44, that is not bad. Definitely gonna have to start cracking some doors open though, since we actually are allowed to use perks on this, unlike the other challenge that we did. But yeah, I am really happy with the STG. We just gotta watch our ammo, because like every other World of War map, minus the giant on this game, there's no Pack-A-Punch machine. God, this really does rival Knack for how slow these spawns are. Jeez, man. Come on, where's our last guy at, man? There. What's the last guy? Where is he at, bro? There? No, bro. It is round three. How many zombies do you want to spawn? There we go, finally. Let's get this door open. Bro, I won't lie, I am chowing down on some smarties right now. They're getting stuck in my teeth hard. I decided, you know what? I'm going for a long recording session today, so I need, like, everything I can get, bro. But then again, there was that thing that blah, blah, blah. There was that thing trending on Twitter that sugar rushes weren't even real, so maybe I'm just making myself fat. Nah, bro, the placebo effects got me. It's chill. All right, we can one-shot headshot these if we're careful. That's a max ammo. Okay. Death machine 2. Come on, where's this last zombie, man? Don't do me like this. There. Reload quick. There we go. Oh, we just missed. It. Oh, I didn't re wait for the reload quick enough. I was too scared I was just going to lose the max ammo. All right, round five. Quarter of the way there. And dog round. I forgot that. I, I always forget they're on here. Joshua Silva, thank you for subscribing. Bro. Well, I don't know why, but whenever I play Shino Numa, I tend to just hang around the flogger area and just, like, forget to buy perks. All right, okay, that is a max ammo. All right, let's go open this next door. Kind of print is just jug, so I don't have to open any other doors. That's just me being really lazy, though. All right, okay, let's see what's behind here. What is it? Speed caller. Not right now, bro. Not right now. Come on, man. Where are my zombie spawns? There they are. I will admit that this map does look gorgeous on BO3. Although it's like really murky, it still captures that like kind of like ZNS vibe. I think they definitely went with a ZNS vibe for this. It must have done. So grab this nuke. It should probably add the round. No, no, wait, no, there we go. Right, nice. Right, let's get this other door open. I don't actually think there's an STG wall by anywhere on the map. Might be wrong though. We have been a couple of times now. That is Juggernaug. That's what I need. I think we're going to stay here and save up my points for it. Because, you know, who doesn't want extra health? You know what I mean? Okay, there we go. Okay, yeah, we are run 
done a little bit low on ammo. It's fine, though. I mean, well, it's not, but... Gotta stay optimistic in situations like this. Also, you can go around here. Why? I don't know. That's a cop, and uh, there's another one for the count. Where is the... Oh, they're there. Blah, 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 blah. I can't speak, man. What is wrong with me today in words? I was gonna say, there they are. Right, we need a max ammo, bro. Or maybe I'm missing an SDG war by some wonder fizz. This door open. That's the M8A7. No. Oh, God, please don't kill me with the mud, man. No, please, go away. All right, we can use the flogger here. Be smart about this. Bro, they get flung so far. Oh, my God. Come on, spawn more frequently. All right, grenade as it is. Oh, what is a guy got to do around here for a max ammo? I should kill a few, honestly. That's an insta-kill. Right, surely that's ended around. Yep, nice one. Who does they are? I really thought we broke through. Oh, hang on. Oh, I just did a 180 and looked at the same wall by. It's fine now. We've got a dog round anyway. It's quite lucky to get it on round nine, to be fair. Oh, I'm using the starting pistol. I literally don't care. Yep, fetch this, man. Bro! I've really got to flog these dogs. I didn't even flog them, bro. It's over. Oh, you can't even use grenades on them, man. Can they just die? Please. Never known B03 dogs to be this annoying. There we go. Go, there's our max ammo. Right, let's go open the last quarter of the map. Maybe the SDG's there? It's not looking good, bruv. Maybe in this hut over here? No, 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 no. Nah. The Argus definitely makes more sense to put there, bro. From World of War map as well. Yeah, the Argus. I remember that weapon. Another carpenter. Oh, there actually is a wall by for it. Oh, we're chilling. We're on round 10. We're about halfway there. It's probably good that we found that now, actually. I have a feeling we're going to need it soon. That's a max ammo. Try to use as many bullets as I can. There we go. That's round. Actually reload properly this time and grab it. It's a nuke. We can take advantage of that, as always. Try kill as many as I can. Right, there we go. Grab it now. It probably won't end the round. No, it didn't. That was wishful thinking, that. I think I'm going to spin the gobble gun machine to see if I can get a kill joint. Nope, I don't want Perkaholic. Guess we'll buy some wall ammo then. Oh, double points. The most useful drop in my situation right now. And that's round. Okay. Eight more to go. We got this. We got this. It's Shino Numa, man. It's fine. I think round 15 is when it starts becoming a little bit unbearable with the unpacked weapon, but we're doing fine. We're doing fine. Grab some more ammo. Okay, there is a lot of them spawning now. My God. And the SDG does not have a lot of ammo. And that is round. Okay. Seven more to go. And I've got one more map to record, and I think that is Shangri-La, because I've done them in a weird order. Not in the video, just the way I've recorded them, because I think I'm just sick of doing them like back to back to back like I usually do. Go ahead and grab speed cooler here. Okay, they're getting a little bit much now. Oh god, but only on 30 bullets as well. Well, okay, Nuke, perfect. Probably we're running back already to buy more ammo. And there we go, that is round again. Things are picking up the pace. Grab this death machine to stay away from the carpenter so it doesn't slow us down. Bro, how many carpenters? It's actually starting to annoy me. That's a dog round. Cheeky little round skip. And there we go. Oh, you've got no idea how relieved I am to be almost done with this video. I had college, like I said, but you've probably heard in some of the other maps. Like, that's going to be so weird because I have recorded these all on different days. But I've had college till like 5 p.m. today, so I don't get into like 6. I'm just shattered, bro. But I stay on that grind. We always stay on that. Otherwise, you guys wouldn't have videos to watch. Now, I'm all ready. We need double tap too. Why haven't I bought that? Turn the flagger on and run away. All right, let's go run and grab some ammo, then we'll go find double tap two. Go. We should actually be nearly at the end of the round, I think. Here we are. That should be last. No, it's not. Okay. I lied once again. This one? Nope. Mm, this one? No, bro. Stop. Just... Uh, gotta find double tap, bro. It's just doing nothing. Well, it is killing them just really slowly. SDG is a solid weapon, though. Like, it is killing them, but it's doing a pharaoh. Arguably, the way later round, but here's double tap two. This is what I wanted. Okay, we're running really low on ammo. Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 bro. We have five bullets. No, 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 no. Oh, there's one running towards me. No. No, 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 no. Oh, there's a swamp here as well. Can I get up on these parts? No, no, no. Uh, why am I red screened after two hits? What is that about? Bro, please, please. That's twice now. The Shino Numa mud has got it. I'm so sick of Shino Numa, bro. Right, okay. Best zombies map of all time. Kino de Toten, Black Ops 3. I am fully joking. It. I hope you guys got that reference. <laughs> Right, okay. So, my plan is for this map, I'm not going to use any Mega Gobble Gums because you end up speeding through the map. All the spawns are all knackered. So, we're going to take this one nice and slow, yeah? We'll figure out where the mystery box is as we go along. Because I feel like this map's a little bit too small to be running about with a shopping free, if you get what I mean. Okay, that is round one done. I've always wondered why this has the buried round change music. Right, let's open this door. Okay, the box is not there. I thought I got lucky. It's also, you can't see it from here. It could be behind the stage. Could also be in the alley. I don't know. This one, hopefully, should be decent. I'm hoping for some decent box looks. There's a lot of, like, older weapons in the box from the older games. I think the MP40's in there. SDG's in there, I'm pretty sure. Not too sure about the, that last one there. Okay, Death Machine, I'll do. Maybe, yeah, just maybe. Box is in here. It is! Okay! Right, it's round three. It's easy. We can just stab them. Okay, we've nearly got enough for the box. 
couple more zombies should do it. There we go. Right, come on. Just me up, please, 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 please. Oh, oh, um, uh oh. Okay, so round five at a push. Uh, no, this is... Oh, that is not good. That is really not good. Wow, this is going to be difficult. Like, usually I'd have some, like, over-the-top laugh reaction, but, like, bro, no, I'm, I'm actually scared. I am not getting past round 10 with this thing. It loses ammo so fast as well. Bro, the odds of us even getting past this door are slim. We're earning no points. We might be better off knifing for now. Well, it looks like we're doing the majority of this probably melee only for the time being until we get onto the stage. Because, my God, is this going to be hard. You know, I was fully expecting just to dodge this weapon entirely and have some really good RNG, but no. No thunder gun for you. No HVK for you. No literally anything else for you. Oh, my God, I'm already red screen, man. This is the problem I'm going to have. Don't get me wrong. It reloads nice and quick, but, like, the explosives, pre-Cold War, it are crazy. Criminal. Mr. Coco 0264. Thank you for subscribing. Okay, we actually get some kills here. Right, okay, we have about 2k points here. We want to get the power we need, I think 2,500. Oh, we're already on eight rockets, bro. Oh, it's over before it even started, man. That's a shame. I was looking forward to playing Kino. Right, let's go through the power here. Right, let's get this switch on. Get this teleporter linked. Bro, what do we even do? If we run out of ammo, we're actually, bro, like, I'm so confused. Like, I actually want, like, right, you watching right now, what would you do in my situation? I'm I'm not allowed to use my starting pistol. All I have is an XM53 and my knife. Okay, we have grenades as well, to be fair. Some crawlers we can stab. I think Kino de Totem's gonna be a lot shorter than I thought it was gonna be. Oh my god, please don't down me. There we go. Can actually get a good rocket in here. Was that a max ammo? Oh, okay, right, hang on. Need to use all the rockets we have to double points as well. Right, okay, that's round. We also got an insta kill. Oh, I wanna save that so bad. Yeah, keep blinking, keep blinking, keep blinking. Right, okay, we use our knife a little bit more here. Might just be enough to get this pack a punch. I'm not even going for perks, bro. We need that pack. We need all the ammo we can get. Oh, the 3k, and it's gone. Okay, right. We need Pack-A-Punch so bad. That thing just went through that crawler's legs. Yeah, okay, I guess we can knife the crawlers. They have weaker health, right? I think. Better to do this on a low round than, like, later. Do you know what I mean? Oh, God, we need to reload. This is actually... Bro, this is a challenge. Okay, I'm just gonna grab this nuke now, right? We need 200 points, then we can go pack. Round 7. Already further than I thought we were gonna get, to be fair with you. It's a dog round. Oh, this might be a bit impossible. I don't know how well the uh, rocket launcher does it against dogs. Hang on. Oh, it's a one shot, right? Okay, that's fine. And since we're getting a max ammo this round, I'm going to hold off on Pack-A-Punch, but I'm just going to keep a hold of the points. I'm not going to spend it on Jug or anything. It's just because we get another 15 rounds of rockets. 20 rounds, actually, of rockets, which is decent. And although it's not Pack-A-Punch, it's still ammo. I don't really want to run through it. Double points, that's actually perfect. I just need them to kind of, like, hoard up in the group so I can use these rockets more efficiently. It's like they're almost doing it on purpose. You know, if this RPG was actually good, I'd probably end up using it a lot more, but it's just not. Okay, right, we've got about five rockets left. We are going to have to go make a mad dash for Pack-A-Punch soon. Oh, I would have preferred to end the round. Oh, wait, we've got grenades. Hang on, hang on. Oh, my God, don't down me. Don't down me. Not by a crawler. Okay, is that round? Wait, what are we waiting on? Oh, it's a full-size zombie. Right, there we go. Right, I'm going now. I cannot believe we've actually got to legitimately use this thing. Who knows? It might be a lot better when it's packed. The Hella Seal... Uh, what the fuck does that say, man? Hella Seal in... The, in I, I can't. Incandescence. What? Bro, I can't read, apparently. Incandescence. Oh, right, okay. Oh, we don't even get more rockets. We just get another one in the clip. Oh, that is such a letdown, bro. We're not surviving. It's so over. We've got a film reel, though. Oh, my God, bro. Okay, to be fair, it's got a pretty big radius. The only problem I have is that we're going to hold them up. Like, that killed them all there. Like, that's that's actually really good. It's just a hoarding part because the round's so low. Oh, nuke. Okay, that ended the round. Right, we're halfway there. I'm actually so surprised. Right, no dog run. I'll be next round, probably. Oh, we can buy Jug. Why have I not done that? Grab this. Right, okay, we're actually, like, surviving. I, I'm so baffled. Right, I'm going to try train them up and, like, use these more efficiently rather than just spamming them at, like, one zombie. Right, we've got a couple here. Right, let's see what this thing can actually do. That killed them all? Wait, right, okay, this thing's actually decent. The only problem is it's going to be really slow. Oh, insta-kill. Never mind. There's our last zombie. Can we get him before insta-kill ends? I thought that was last zombie. I didn't want a death machine. Where did I pull that up? I didn't even see the drop. Nova Call is the last zombie, man. Right, there we go. Right. 4,000 points. Is it worth getting double tap too? I don't know if that even doubles or that. I can see. It's worth a shot, at least. Okay, there's double tap. Well, it definitely does kill them. I just don't know when it's going to stop. We're also getting dangerously low on ammo. If I can survive to round 20 with an XM53 on Kino. Oh my god, max ammo. I'm going to be so... I, I, oh my god, bro. Why have we just got back-to-back -back max ammos? It keeps cutting me off. Right, hang on. Try to use this to a full potential. 
potential. This is no Helion Salvo, but it's not too bad. Come on, that must be nearly end of round. Right, okay, round 12. Nice. Let's go. Okay, dog round as well. Okay, we're chilling, we're chilling, we're chilling. Nice little round skip as well. See, that's probably how we're gonna die, I think. I keep getting, like, splash damage when they get too close like that. Okay, there's our max ammo. Reload. Okay, round 13. If I sound really monotone, I do apologize. I'm just trying to focus. I'm gonna spin Wonderfuzz, actually. Stamina up? I don't want that. Okay, they're starting to sprint now. This is becoming a little bit easier to hold. Saying that, if they get enough swipes on me, I am gonna go down. Okay, it's still killing them. That's good, that's good. Oh, God, see, this is what I mean, bro. I'm gonna grab this nuke now. It's probably not gonna end the round, but... I feel like we are making good progress, though. Okay, I'm wasting so much ammo here. Is that last? No, bro, come on. Can they just hurry up? Right, okay, round 14. Almost went down, because I, I got in a bit of a stabbing contest with a zombie. We got six shots. I don't know if we're making it to 20. This might be, like, probably the only one we fail. We have two goals of the trap as well that we can use, actually. I'm gonna use start using that after we've run out of ammo. Oh, I really hate hoarding, man. I don't know why. I just don't like it. All right, I killed them all. Right, I'm using this death machine. <sighs> insta-kill. Okay, right, hang on. And the double points. I'm gonna wait till this insta-kill expires or the death machine starts flashing, and then I'll pick it up. There's a nuke here as well. Okay, the drops really helped out that round. Okay, they should probably end the round, actually. Please. Oh, bro, for round 14, it's going so slow. Right, okay, round 15. Two shots left. We can have oh, quite a few goals on the trap, to be fair. It's not looking good, though. Unless we get blessed up with a dog round. But no. Okay. Right, we'll hold them up twice and then start using the trap. And hopefully we might get a max ammo. Okay, that is a lot of them. I don't know if it's going to kill them with one rocket, but... Uh, well, it did pretty well. I need that insta-kill, though. All right, start knifing. Death machine. No! Oh, my God. That was the stupidest down ever, man. Let's go get Jug back quick. Quick, quick, quick. I need out of this hole. You go grab quick revive as well. Go. One more rocket. Oh my god, let me through. Anything? No. Oh god, we're down to grenades. I'm actually doing whole map trains with grenades. It's how bad it's gotten. Did that actually kill any of them? Got like one more grenade and that's it. Two, three, four. Didn't do much. I just have to stab them. Oh man, I keep try like almost losing those fights where I just keep like knifing them, man. You don't know how bad I want to use my pistol, but I'm, I'm sticking them out. I'm sticking them what I said. It's not dire enough that we have to use it yet. Come on, you're the last one, surely. Come on, man. There we go. Oh, there's another one. There we go. Please be a dog round, for the love of God. Yes, 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 yes. We're all right. We can use the trap. Does it actually kill them? No, it can't keep up with them. Oh, to be fair, it is killing them. Kind of. It went off. Right, turn it back on. Oh, I'm so glad it has no cooldown, man. Please kill them. Trap, please, man. You're so close, please. Yes! Oh my god, we live to see another day. Right, I reckon we could probably get around 20 now. Hopefully, hopefully. I need to remember not to waste my ammo. We need a horde. It's around 17. It's a high enough round. They're all sprinting now, surely. Okay, right, let's use one. No drops. Uh. Right, maybe we should turn on the trap here. But we've had no drops this round. What is going on? Let the trap try and take care of some things. Oh, it hurts me. Surely this round's got to be over soon, right? Turn the trap back on. Got a little system going. It's working, kind of. The only downside of the trap, I don't think you get drops from it. Come on. Surely it's got to be, like, near enough last zombie. I don't know why Kino is so slow on BO3. It's ridiculous. All right, there we go. Round 18. Oh, two more rounds to go. We've got this. Surely we've got this, right? We've got one more go on the trap. Possibly two if we get enough points. Which we will probably. We'll get a good horde. Right, they're full-blown sprinting now. Right, okay. I'm going to try and get like, one giant horde and see how it does. Right, okay. Oh, my God. That pretty much killed them. Oh, max ammo as well. Bro, we're chilling. We're high-key chilling. All right, get the trap on to pick off the excess. Jesus, they're still spawning. All right, let's get another horde going then. All right, see how that does. Didn't do much, actually. It might be starting to drop off now, which is bad. Bad news for us, considering we've got another round to survive. All right, okay. Speaking of which, round 19. All right, we should have enough rockets to get through the round. Just about. Okay, this horde's getting pretty big now. Rocket pretty much killed them all. Maybe it's not dropping off. All right, okay, I'm going to turn the trap on. Oh, they are still full-blown spawning. Oh, Max Ammo, bro. Oh, we, we, we've done it. We've actually done it. We've actually beat round 20 with a pack of punched XM53. The one-box challenge, they got nothing on us, bro. Come on, round. Please just end. Oh, I'm, so, I'm actually so gassed about that, man. Let's go. Go! Round 20 with the XM53. This challenge ain't got nothing on us, bro. All right, on to Ascension. Okay, so, Ascension. The second BO1 Zombies Chronicles map. All right, let's see what we get from the Gobblegum Machine here. That does not look like a shopping free to me. Don't think I'm going to want Perkaholic on this one because of the monkeys. All right, well, let's get started then. Oh, watch out. That thing's going to start spinning. Like I've said in the last video, well, the video before last video, or maybe even before that, I don't remember this thing spinning in BO1 when the power's off. All right, okay, that is 
round one completed. I do really want to shop them free though, because I feel like it would make our lives a lot easier. And I do just want to get the box as fast as possible. That's not a shopping free. I don't want Perkolic. We'll grab Quick Revive for now and we'll just spend maybe a couple more rounds in here. I'm trying to build as many points as I can off these early rounds here. Just so we have enough for like Jug and all that good stuff. And there we go. That's round. Please give me a shopping free. So I have completely run out of ammo and we are kind of knackered if we can't get a shopping free here because we've got no ammo. Oh, that's not good. Okay, right. I'm going to pop the round robin just for the sake of getting up to the box here. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Finally. Right, let's go. It's like a maze sometimes, this map. Head all the way up. This open. Get the power on. Everything becomes really saturated. Ow, my eyes. Double points. We can't really utilize that though, but this open. This one open. Quickly run over here. Get this door open. And this. This one. Nice one. Right, okay then. Let's go spin the box. Maybe we'll get Thunder Gun. I mean, anything's possible. We got Ray Gun on Zetsubo no Shima, so come on. Juice me up. Juice me up. I'm not looking. I'm looking. I'm not looking. The Vesper. Okay, well, we are going to be running out of ammo very, very fast. It's going to take it nice and slow with this, I think. Wow, that is not a good weapon to have to use for the rest of the game. Greg the Dummy, thank you for subscribing, bro. Right, we're on round five. We're doing well. We're doing well. Quarter of the way there. Wait, hang on a minute. That's the Alpha Omega Clock. What the fuck? Guys, bo 4 is an original game. Right, we should probably start doing the Lunar Landers, huh? Let's get this one called over. There it is. Got to wait for it to refuel now. Wait, what's my boy doing up there? That is a nuke. I'm going to grab that. All right, okay, let's take this lander. Okay, monkey round. The only perk we've got to defend is Quick Revive, and luckily enough, we're right here. They're actually terrifying on BO3, like, coming in. That last one? Nope. Yep, you're the last one. Okay, we got a free perk as well. Widow's Wine. That is huge. Let's grab Juggernaut while we're here. All right, we are chilling, bro. Yusuf Chowd Hurry. Huri? Hurry? I don't know. Thank you for subscribing nonetheless. Okay, let's get this. Ascension, especially with these challenges, is always usually a quick one. But, you know, I do quite like the BO3 remaster of it. Like, a lot. It just it makes the whole map just look so much better. I feel like it's more saturated than it was compared to BO1 because on BO1 it looks worse than Moon, man. All right, okay, let's take this lander away. All right, we've got one more left to do, and then we're going to launch a rocket. And then that is Pack a Punch Open. Now, only if I can remember where this last Lunar Lander is, would it be sorted. Oh, it's Junkyard. We're not too far away from it. Saying that Ascension's not really that big of a map. Well, for BO1, actually, it's quite sizable, but, like, in the grand scheme of things, it's nothing, man. Oh, come on, give me a couple of more kills, please. No, bro. We're probably gonna have to pack this Vesper pretty soon. Right, let's get this Lunar Lander called. Okay, we have enough for pack a bunch. That's not too bad. There's the lander. I don't want to stand right in its path. All right, okay, let's go. And there we go. The rocket's getting in position now. That's it. Bro, how many drops? Right, let's go launch this rocket then. It's insane how this was in a BO1 map, man. You get to launch a rocket. Unfortunately, because we don't have a wonder weapon, we can't shoot this thing down, but we can still watch it take off. Off it goes. Right, okay, I think I'm honestly gonna go play it safe and just get this Vesper pack a punch, and then we'll train by the Lunar Lander next to Widow's Wine. Oh, never mind. Okay, max ammo. Right, we've got a little bit left in it. Come on, where's the last zombie, man? Can I turn the power off? Right, okay, that is round nine. I am just gonna go pack a punch this thing because we need as much ammo as we can get. This is ridiculous, man. Right, we can double pack it, though, to be fair. Right, we've got Blast Furnace. That's good enough for me. Right, Right, let's head back over to the first Lunar Lander, and we'll train by there, because I think that's got the fastest spawns. Bro, AATs are so bugged, man. <laughs> Actually kind of ridiculous now looking back on it. You can survive round 100 with an RK5 with an AAT on it, and it's purely because it has an AAT. Right, okay, halfway there, round 10. That carpenter's probably slowed us down quite a bit, actually. We're still doing okay for ammo, to be fair. Just gonna have to remember to, like, you know, tap fire when there's only one zombie instead of just letting into them. I right, got a nuke there. Got an insta kill. Means we can save on our ammo here. I think BO3 was the game that definitely perfected how long melee intakes. Right, there we go. That's round 10 done. Oh, nine more to go. We got this. Ah, never mind. I forgot about the monkeys. We got three perks now. This might actually be a little bit difficult. We'll just see which ones they go to first. It's not the end of the world if we have to, you know, rebuy them. Right, quick revive's going first. I don't even know if we're going to have time to make it back there. And jug, bro. No, get off my jug. Now. Get off. Are we going to have time to get a quick revive? I'd prefer to, you know, get there before they take it. There we go. Okay. Max ammo. Perfect. And we didn't lose a single perk. Right, okay, we should be chilling for a little while now. I can never remember where Double Tap is on this map. Is it even on this map? I'm gaslighting myself. Okay, there's a few of them starting to come through now. We're going to be eating through bullets. All right, just tap fire. Just tap fire. That last? And there's a couple more. Oh, why did it have to be the Vespa, man? Okay, round 13. Not too shabby. 
Our ammo count is not looking good. This might be one of the first ones we fail. I don't even know if there's a Vespa wall bite on this map. If there is, I'll have to Google its location. Okay, yeah, things are looking a bit dire. I'm saying it's fair game to use the starting pistol for now. We can also use our Widow's Wine Grenades because they actually do a lot of damage. Oh, nuke perfect. Come on, Vespa, you can't be far. What's this? It's HVK. Got the Sickle. We can't buy that, unfortunately. I don't think it's a Vespa wall bite, bro. We're kind of looking at a potential failure here if we don't get a max ammo soon. That's the KN44, bro. Okay, I guess we'll use the trap. Hang on. Use this. You're the transit bus. There's the Vespa wall by. Oh my god, I knew there was one on this map. There has to be. Oh god, please don't down me. Oh, it's a few zombies. Although this thing's high rate of fires, mint for getting out of corners and stuff, bro. It sucks for keeping ammo and buying it like every two seconds. Treyarch, if you're gonna make a gun like this and the Spitfire in. I'm gonna grab stamina up. And the Spitfire in BO4, give it more ammo, man. We're nearly there, anyways. Now that we have a war by, we should be chilling. That's a max ammo, too, and a death machine. Let's try to use the rest of my ammo here. We can probably get through it, to be fair. Right, there we go. Okay, and that is round. Four more to go. We've got this. We've got this, man. Monkey rounder, get really? Right, what perks are they going after first? None of them are blinking so far, to be fair. Oh, my God, that was the last. Okay, what perk are we getting? Deadshot Daiquiri out of everything it could have gave us, bro. What a joke. Anyway, round skips are round skip. Three more to go. Come on. Oh, double points. That's good, actually, because the ammo's expensive for this gun. 4,500. That is criminal for pack a bunch of ammo. Right, let's grab this insta kill here. Bro, we're making so many points. Insta kill and double points is like a ridiculous combo to have, especially on BO3 because you can knife like a million times a second. Do you not think the rocket shield would be most fitting for ascension? Could they not have not just slapped it in as like a little Easter egg? That's a max ammo as well. Like just as a little side Easter egg that you can get, like maybe by doing a little quest that they added in or something. Bro, the rocket shield would have been sick. Could have made it look like all Russian and stuff too. I'm telling you now, Treyarch should have hired me, bro. A, a nuke already. Uh, <laughs> not long left now. Saying that, I don't think our ammo situation has long left either. Oh my god. For and out. It's Ali X. Thank you for subscribing. Okay, round 19. Let's go quickly run and buy some ammo and then we're good. If I remembered the right way for ammo, probably be a good start. There we go. This should hopefully see us through to the end of round 20. Well, the end of round 19, sorry. Okay, they're really... I'm already nearly out as well. They're already, like, sprinting at me too. This is not good. I have one Widow's Grenade and I just accidentally threw it. Right, okay, hang on. We're gonna pull something off here. Oh, what was that? Double points, never mind. Doesn't concern me. Turn this on. Grab some ammo. Really thought that would be enough when we bought it last time, though. So did that turret trap just kill none of them then? That's great. And there we go, round 20. That was honestly pretty painless. Vespa good weapon literally the worst ammo in the game though all right on to shangri-la right okay shangri-la grab some quick revive here and i am gonna go spin the gobblegum machine because shot oh, shot free first get that open get that open i guess we're going down here we'll take this route because uh, the mud room wanted us to get this open this open this one open this will lead us straight to power i'm pretty sure run straight through the other side though that door open this one and then i think we're pretty much done so let's hit the box what we getting please just give me the baby gun please the weevil okay that is a lot of ammo for a tiny gun let's go get the power switches on yeah the weevil that is a weird one we haven't had it yet but definitely better than an xm53 or something like that there's one power switch and there's another one why is widow's wine down there i've never noticed that our odds of getting around 20 with the weevil though pretty slim but we do have a pack a punch machine available to us so we can use that and the switch is here and there's the first round gone 18 more to go you know what it seems so vast from now but like honestly once you start get past like round 10 ish it just flies Eyes. And then, like you've seen probably throughout this video, I've struggled quite bad with some of the World of War maps. Even Rev. Got Killjoy here. We'll use that at some point. Maybe not right now. Yeah, this is what I mean. It starts off so slow, and then once it, like, ramps up, bro, you're just going. Our only issue really is ammo, because, like, it's a box weapon. There's no wall buy for it, so it's not fair game to, you know, get more ammo. Because, you know, we couldn't even get it even if we wanted to. I'm saying too many words for, like, a tiny little point. There we go. We finally got back over to here. Honestly, the spawn room, from what I remember from the last time, was pretty decent to stay in. We know where the pack a punch switches we can just save up for that we can just chill bro. oh we got max ammo we actually timed that pretty well with the monkey there come on where's the last zombie you can't be far do have enough for jug as well so let's quickly run over and grab that or not because the mud room hates us we'll just go through the mud give me jug go okay round four not really too much to say about it really we're just really like, like i can't lie the hardest thing about this challenge for me is playing through the early rounds over and over and over again because they're so slow man and as much as i love zombies they do drag on a lot drag on. Ha, <laughs> that's funny. Hence why I'm jump cutting all over the place as well a little bit, because you know, uh, everybody knows the early rounds are boring. Come on, take my drop, turn into a max ammo. You know you want to. No max ammo for us. 
as a double points though, always nice. Actually, we could turn this into a max ammo. Come on. There we go. Round five. 15 more to go. Bro, look at this guy just sitting and looking. Who do you think he is? I think next course of action is probably just to get the Weevil upgraded. So we'll just keep saving our points until then. We have some killjoys in case we run out of ammo, bro. We are good. Oh, max ammo. Perfect. Right, we have enough to upgrade the Weevil, but I'm going to hold off just so we can get a double pack going. Right, round six. God, I'm tired, man. All right, we've got 6k points. We need 7,500 for a double pack and a regular pack. Just need a few more points now. Okay, that might actually end the round. I'm not too sure. No, it did not. I think round six is my unlucky number with Lu with like Luke's with nukes, I meant. Carpenter. Come on, come take it. Right, turn it into something else quick. I'll take a nuke. I oh, double points. Never mind. I don't know what Black Ops 1's obsession with monkeys was, honestly. They were on Ascension. They were here. There was references to them on Moon. Oh, it's a Shrieker zombie. I forgot they were on this. Oh, Napalms as well. Literally my worst nightmare. Go away. Thank you. Right, we're going to go stand on the switch so we can get this uh, Weevil Packer punched. Let me try to use as much of this thing's ammo as I can, though, first. Just to, you know, not be wasteful. Come on, this round should be nearly done by now. There. Let's drop down here. I always forget that that's there. And uh, let's stand on this switch. And I'm pretty sure we can just go back up the way we came because it's a water spout, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Right, okay. We need to be fast here because that stone's already approaching. Chuck that in there. There we go. And get that in there again. Dead wire. Perfect. Insta kill means we can knife a little bit. I keep mistaking that zombie for... I keep mistaking that monkey for a zombie, sorry. Oh, nuke already. And the napalm, bro. It's, oh, it's my most unlucky day. That, oh, I thought he was going to explode there. Round nine. We're almost halfway there. I'd say so far, honestly, right? We've done all right. Not the best with the world at war maps, but we've done pretty well. One of these days, I'm going to have to do one of these videos where it's flawless or nothing, bro. Shrieker, go away, man. Just making me experience real life simulator, bro. It's so hard being blind. <laughs> I'm, I'm not actually blind. <laughs> if I fooled anyone, no, I just have really terrible eyesight. Right, okay, surely there's only like one or two zombies left. Okay, that is round. Right, we are officially halfway there, and I think that's a like napalm spawning in again. We've got a nuke there. Ah, Jesus Christ, man. Where's the Shrieker? There, he's dead. Nice little max ammo from the monkeys there. Bro, I'm like pre firing these zombies. This is what I mean, bro. Spawn is like the best place to stay on this map. This map does look gorgeous as well on BO3. And that is round 10. Right. Things are going to start picking up now, and that's not good for Shangri-La because it's so close quarters. We do have some killjoys, though. I need to remember to use them. Honestly, right, the Weevil has been killing it. We haven't even bought Double Tap 2, and it's still just mowing through them. I don't know why people dissed on this gun so hard. In a way, kind of, minus the fire rate. It kind of reminds me of the PPSH because it's got such a high mag count. Oh, max ammo as well. Things are looking in our favor. And that is round. Eight more to go. Oh, Shrieker, go away. Oh, a nuke. Okay, okay. He did something good. We're just closing in about the end of round 12 now. And yeah, we are. Okay, round 13, bro. I feel like this is going like far too quick. Maybe it's like placebo because it's the last one. Well, for me anyways. Like I said, I've recorded these in a really weird order. So right now, I'm extremely tired, bro. It's another Shrieker, I think. Let's pop a uh, Killjoy here. Get some use out of it. So this river is not going to use it. It's another max ammo as well, bro. The game just wants us to succeed. We have... 30k points. That's insane. I might just pack a bunch of the Mustang and Sally's just for the sake of it. And that is round 13. Ooh, we're getting close now. I think with these past two days, I've had like a grand total of, a, I think, around seven and a half hours sleep. I'm really not living healthily, bro, but I don't know. I just can't sleep lately. Oh, there's a napalm about. It's an insta-kill. Easily take care of him now. Oh, wait. Insta-kill doesn't affect him. What? Oh, my God. He took like 50 bullets. I feel like we're at the end of round 14 already as well. <laughs> yeah, we are. Oh, God. We are running dangerously low on ammo. I'm going to pop a kill, Joe. Actually, wait, I might let the monkey... Oh, I was going to say I might let the monkeys take that, but no, we went down. That was ridiculous. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Whoa! Oh, why did I run past the insta-kill as if I was going to come back and get it for the monkey? Austin Medina, thank you for subscribing, bro. Oh. All right, okay, here we are, moon, and luckily enough, we got Jug here. I am going to try spin for a shopping for you once we actually get off of this planet. So I want to be hitting the box as soon as possible, bro. Okay, we're actually getting a fair few kills in here, right? We nearly got enough. Luckily for us on this version of the game, the dogs pop like balloons, so... Right, okay, that is enough for Jug. Grab this, and let's get out of here. Grab my PES, chuck that on. Right, come on, shopping free. No, man, that could have been something. Dead a nuclear winter, sure, though. Quite happy that we got Jug and not speed call, and I wasn't fast restarting for, like, years. Bro, this has to be one of the fastest start rooms because that's round one done already gonna grab quick revive come on juice me up no bro i don't want widow's wine and all that stuff oh god we actually gotta stay away from him probably gonna decompress this area no we got a death machine out of it though perfect right come on come on come on come on shopping free say it with me shopping free that is not a shopping free bro grab this anyway we'll use it 
Spin it again. Right, okay, I'm glad we got the other purple one out of the way. Killjoy. This has to be a shopping free, right? Yeah, there we go. All right, let's go. I use the shopping free on the bigger maps because, you know, I just want to get to the box a lot faster and start the challenge, if you get what I mean. God, running through the tunnels and sliding and stuff was really not made for BO3. Jesus. I'm going to try to get everywhere I can open possible. We have enough points for the box, so we don't need to worry about that. Get the power on. Get this door open. Yeah, we'll grab double tap. Get this door open. That one. And this one. And I reckon if we're fast, we can also grab Widow's wine it's gonna be close though very close yeah let's go right, we're pretty much set up on round four and a max ammo bro we're chilling now we need is the hacker and we need to go hit the box and then we're done we'll get the hacker after we hit the box of course because there's no oxygen where the box is how many times did i just say box in that sentence right come on juice me up juice me up wave gun wave gun oh my god man not again Oh, I guess we're doing this again. Right, okay, whatever. We can we can knife them for now. We got Widow's Wine. You know, out of, like, the 70 million guns in the box, right? And that's an accurate number. It gives me the rocket launcher. It knows I'm doing this challenge, bro. That's why it's giving me so many carpenters. That's why we're getting such bad RNG. Game hates me, man. Oh, and these Nova Crawlers. Go away, man. How long can we get away with just knifing them? Oh, well, not long. It's already a two knife. Right, that is a nuke. I don't know if that's going to end the round, though. Oh, we're going to overshoot that. No, we're not. Oh, we're overshooting. Oh, wait, no, we're not. We're chilling. We're chilling. But yeah. No, XM53 again. It is going to be a long one. At least we can breathe in here, though. And for now, knifing isn't so bad because we did actually manage to grab Widow's Wine. It's just these later rounds are going to drag, man. And... Oh, I thought that would have been round. Oh, no, there's round, bro. You're going to end the round, aren't you? Yeah, there we go. Oh, I can't believe we got the XM, man. I'm going to be complaining to the end of this run, man. To be fair, we can go pack a punch it, but I feel like it'd be a waste to go do that now. I'm going to stick the man knife on round six, by the way. Oh, insta-kill. Perfect. This might have been a melee only video man god's sake all right okay and that is round all right round seven getting through these quite quick to be fair the biodome is always a good training spot still a two knife that is great for us it's not high enough round where we can actually start holding them up yet so i'm just gonna refrain on using the rpg as a whole so i guess right now it's a melee only challenge like i said double points i don't think we can get aat oh we can use an rpg there definitely i don't think we can get an aat on the xm53 though so any points right now are kind of useless honestly all right where is last zombie at all right nice that's round round eight Oh, you are joking. Oh, of course. Of course, Biodome. Why, why Why? wouldn't it just be like Tunnel 11? You know, the one place I didn't open. No, Biodome. Where's the hacker? I can't even use my gun indoors. Especially not in these parts either. Because, like, the windows are made out of, like, silly string. I don't know. Like, I'm pretty sure Widow's wine grenades break them. There's the hacker. Right, okay, we're chilling. Run past the astronaut here. I really don't want to die. All right, we're in Tunnel 6. We're chilling. You know, I'd rather not be doing this. I'd rather just be, like, folks on the end of the round, you know, getting through. But nah, 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 nah bro. Epsilon decided to go crazy today. Not that one. Where's Biodome's terminal? Three, huh? No. There it is. It's on this side. Okay. And there we go. Oh, wait. We're gonna massive decompression anyway, bro. It's over. I'm going back to my safe space. Yep. Explosive weapons and moon really don't go hand in hand. Honestly, it's not even just the fact that we've got an RPG as our main weapon. Everything on this map seems like it wants to just be a nuisance. Like, the astronaut explodes. Your widow's wine grenades break the windows. Like, you just can't win. And we're home. We're actually doing okay for ammo, to be fair. I think we've mainly just got to watch out for one splashback damage and two getting backed into a corner now neither of those things are great but when you pair it with a rocket launcher and no phd not good times okay and that is round we might actually be able to start holding them now i'm not too sure this is about around the same time we could on kino uh oh, widow's wine messing me up see this perk is a double-edged sword it's really really good for getting you out of sticky situations or when you're just trying to like do something like turn off the excavators but when you're trying to hoard man it just makes everything so difficult got death machine here also i don't know if you guys I saw, but in game and news recently, the GTA 6 trailer just dropped. I've seen all the zombies creators make GTA 6 videos, and this is kind of funny to me. Like, I don't think I'd ever do that. You could probably hold me to this in a few years' time when my channel's, like, dead in the water. But, <laughs> but um, I don't know. I just, I, I can't, I can't see many of you watching a GTA 6 video. But, yeah, no, it was sick. The trailer was sick. All right, let's head back to Area 51. I'm going to go pack this gun. All right, okay, I am going to hack this really quick just to, you know, as a safety measure because we only have an RPG. Get that hacked. Chuck that in there. All right, can we double pack it? No, we can't. I thought as much, to be fair. Okay, is it going to open the gate. I really don't want to die. Okay. Right, Widow's Wine definitely saved me there. Not going to waste my ammo on zombies that don't count for the round, so I'm gone. Alright, we need to get to a tunnel. Alright, we're chilling, bro. Gotta get back
back to the biodome though. I knew we were gonna get an XM53. I wouldn't have picked up double tap. Not gonna grab that carbon. Uh, that's another one for the person who might be counting. I don't know. Probably none of you have done it, but if you do, I'll. I don't know what I'll do. I'll be very amazed if you're just skimming through the video. And I know there's one of you out there. I'm. I'm watching you. I've basically said I want you, someone to count how many carboners I've had this run because it's been ridiculous. It's almost as if the game knows we're doing this challenge. Okay, yeah, it's a four knife now. That's kind of maybe a little bit too much. Oh, insta kill, perfect. All right, and that is round. Making good progress. Oh, come on. I need a max ammo or just something, man. We're not surviving much longer if we don't get one. Treyarch missed an absolute diamond of, of an opportunity to, like, put, like, space dogs on here. I know they did actually make the reference to the space dog meme, but, like, could you imagine, bro? I don't want to grab that nuke. It's just going to slow it down. Okay, death machine. Kill as many as I can. Kill as many as I can. Is that in round? Yes. Okay, we used that so well there. All right, one more rocket. That's not good. All right, let's try to spin for, like, a killjoy or something. That's a shopping free. You know, if you give me this first. What? Right, turn on 11 to go and it's fine. All right, please, please, please. No, dead nuclear winner. I don't want that. Killjoy is what I'd prefer. That's Perkaholic. Oh, we got an insta kill. That'll probably get us through the majority of this round, but I still do want a Killjoy just to get us through the next couple because we literally have no ammo and that is Killjoy. Perfect. I'd say things are dire enough for us to be using the starting pistol here. And in any way, whatever we use is going to be killing them anyway. Omar, thank you for subscribing. Come on, where's this last zombie at? Surely he'll drop max ammo. Realistically, the next drop we get I've, I've, I've just been absolutely square headed there we can hack the next drop we get and it'll turn into a max ammo no right let's try to do that oh wait hang on we can do that now we have a killjoy but yeah i'm gonna use one of them sure 5k points is criminal though there we go i forgot that was a feature wait, we're chilling shangri-la is gonna be such a swing and a miss if we get like the xm oh and then we get a max ammo just wasted one of my insta kills okay right use it to its fullest potential like i was saying no shangri-la definitely gonna be a swing and a miss i already just have a feeling or maybe we get the baby gun. I'm gonna reload and then grab it. You know what it is? The pack punch the XM isn't that bad for the lower high rounds. I will say it, but it's just so clunky, and I just have like a million other guns I'd rather use. I think I'd actually rather use the SMR. That's a lie. I am lying through my back teeth. Pop a killjoy to save some ammo here since it's nearing the end of the round. Oh, you can sod off. How many knives is it now to kill a zombie? A few. To say the least. And there goes tunnel 11, but we don't even have that open, so it doesn't bother me. Right, okay. We can definitely start hoarding now. It's round 14. That's. See, that killed a lot of them. I'm actually curious as to how much damage this thing actually does. If anybody knows in the comments, please let me know. I want to know if I'm just, like, talking a bunch of smack about the weapon, but then it actually turns out it's, like, one of the highest damage buffers in BO3 or something. All right, I am going to use this double points to get a max ammo quick. Hurry up. That's going to go away before I get it in it. In it, bastard. Okay, round robin. I don't need that. What I do need, though, is literally any drop from a zombie. Or maybe from the gobble gun machine. No, that's a perkaholic. Cheers. Okay, we got a decent horde going here. Oh, no. Red as wine just ruined it. Okay, right. We got a bunch. 100 drops. Can we hack the Widow's Wine one? No. Right, give me the nuke. Right, I'd prefer to not die getting this thing. Jesus Christ, okay. Oh, never mind. Right, we got the max ammo. That's all that matters. We got 30k points. Who cares? Yeah, bro, I'm gonna go pick up Deadshot Daiquiri. Pinions? Grab double tap again. I know I said I didn't want to grab it, but I feel like it's helping with damage. Oh, let's not die. Let's not die. Right, I am gonna go back to the teleporter. It should be on by now, surely. Because I think Juggernaut should be there by now. You'd hope. Yeah, the speed color was just there. There we go. There's Jug. Really just sacrifice literally everything for a max ammo. Right, let's go. Grab the PES. I don't really want the hacker anymore because we got to run through a bunch of areas that are now decompressed. I forgot to grab quick revive, bro. Why am I so like absent-minded today? No, 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 no. Okay, I escaped that somehow. How? I just pressed like, the S key and he just like let go. Bro got a little scared. Oh, death machine. Perfect. Right, go with Mr. Chubb. Okay, that is round. Round 16. Must not have much of it left to do once we left. Bro, seeing the excavator that up close is scary, man. No, usually trade in the spawn room is the high round strategy for moon but like i don't think this is the play with the xm53 bro i know the area is already decompressed that's not what i'm worried about it's just more so like literally everything else we're getting like swarmed and um, we're out of ammo okay we need to get out of here can the gobble gun machine help me out i don't know what is this round robin i guess yeah sure we'll pop it why not shopping free bro just give me killjoy dead a new killer win now what is this bro i'm being trolled right there killjoy that's what right situations looking pretty dire never never mind i thought that was a warning by the way let's not die on an instant to kill and just get a max ammo. I thought she was saying like warning, oh, Tunnel 6 is about to go next. My ears are really hearing what they want to hear. I don't know why. I would prefer, I would prefer to have the hacker in my inventory rather than the PES now that we're over here. No, no, bro. Oh. Bro, uh, what do I do? I'm hopping down. I don't want that. Oh. Really, I really don't want to decompress this area, man. Okay, okay, nuke. Okay, I'll do. Oh, we lost Jug as well, man. Okay, that's round at least. You know what, bro? We're picking up Deadshot. Right, that's Tunnel 6 going. 
Right, we literally can only stay in the biodome. No more quick revive. It's our last chance. I'm gonna pick up Widow's Wine as well. That should help out. Go. Pop a killjoy. Use the starting pistol a little bit. Since I did say that was okay, we we're allowed to do that. Since the kill. Come on, man. We're nearly there. Oh, they're still spawning in though. Oh, max ammo. Oh my god, don't die, don't die, don't die. Not now. Not now. Not now. That rocket just phased through that zombie. That was actually like next level tomfoolery. Right, okay, that's brown. One more. One more to go. We've got this. Just don't die, bro. It's a skill issue if I do. It's gonna run back and forth with the XM53. We have the ammo for this round, I think. I think. Massive quotation mark. Oh, we definitely do now. There's a death machine there. We're chilling. Insta-kill as well. Oh my god, it's just helped me along. I think we're actually pretty close to the end of the round already. I mean, one would like to think. I oh, there we go. Round 20, bro. And no jug, no quick revive. XM53. I'm the best zombies player on the Origins. Right, okay. The last one of them all. Origins. Right, the one-box challenge on Origins. I swear to god, I'm getting flashbacks already to when we did the two-box challenge. That was a little while ago now. So to make it a bit clear with this map, well, clearer, we are not allowed to use the staffs at all. We're allowed to use gobble gun, just not the staffs, because, you know, I have not got a clue where the box is, but we will find it. I know we will. It's got to be there somewhere. <laughs> Spin the gobble gun machine here to see if we can get a shopping free. No, it doesn't look like one. Now, whether or not we get to the goal around 20 is severely dependent on whether or not we get, like, the XM53 from the box, because the Panzer on this map is going to fuck us up. Right, okay, I'm going to get moving and see where the box is at. I think it's over by Gen 3, but we'll just go through here anyway. Get this on. Should probably look into getting the shield pieces as well. That's going to come in quite handy. It's not like we can't buy perks or anything. It's just things are going to be a lot harder without, like, a decent weapon, I'd imagine. Unless we get, like, the MG08, but that is thinking very, very positively, to say the least. I don't think positively. I think realistically, bro. I'm Sigma. Jesus Christ, I feel ill at what I've just said there. Oh, shit. There we go. Right, okay, we're going to have to stab and use grenades. Actually, a grenade would probably be a lot more helpful here than knifing. Ooh. Oh, max ammo. Right, let's get the box open. All right, come on. VMP. Okay. This could go pretty well, actually. Cheeky little a pack of punch, you know. This could go very, very well. That could have been a whole lot worse. I'm happy with that, honestly. Let's get this door open. Let's head for Gen 4. Uh, we have 1, 2, and 3 on. Yep. So we need to do 4, 5, and 6. I'm going to spin the gobble gun machine just in case we get something. Yep, that is what I wanted. A perkaholic. Thank you very much. Makes my life just a little bit easier. Now, the VMP, I don't necessarily have a problem with it, but it is notoriously terrible for ammo management. So we'll just have to wait and see how things go, honestly. Also, Origins with no staffs, bro. Just feels weird. Oh, double points. And a death machine. I'm also making it a rule that we're not allowed to pack this and get the Boom Hilda because I feel like that would just make this way too easy. We're only allowed to use this VMP and this VMP alone. So getting Pack-A-Punch on is of, like, utmost importance. Feels so nice to be back on BO3, man. You have no idea. Don't get me wrong. I don't mind BO4. In fact, I think it's a decent game, but it's engine and the way it plays, the way you can't hoard on it and stuff, just feels so much nicer. <laughs> I hope that's not just a me thing. I really do feel like you can't hoard on BO4. It's, like, almost impossible. You've always got to be on the move, and would you look at that, we've already got 40 bullets in the VMP left. Right, I'm gonna grab the uh, nuke here. I think there's a VMP war buy on this map, but I'm not sure where it's at, so we'll just have to stick with the three bullets that we have and get Pack-A-Punch on and stuff. What would help right now is if we can pull a shot and free. I don't know if we've spun the gobble gun machine this round. Let's see. Oh, perfect, man. Let's go. Right, okay. Means we can get these doors open and then, like, you know, save our points for Pack-A-Punch. That open. That open. That one. Right, okay, I have not got a clue where this VMP war buy actually is. Is it down there in the, uh, ice tunnel. If we're fast, we might actually be able to make it back to pack a punch in time. I'm not hopeful, though. Right, if I'm quick, and I mean quick, we could probably do it. Oh, no, no chance. I thought we had way more time. Why did I just prone? I thought we had way more time than what we did. Okay, we're fully out. I guess we've got to rely on the unpacked starting pistol. Oh, there's a shield piece. We get that. Got to rely on the unpacked starting pistol in a dream. I'm gonna go look for the other shield pieces here as well. Honestly, not too shabby for round six. It's still headshotting them. Takes a few bullets and maybe a little electric cherry zap, but it still works. It's doable. Oh, we can use Widow's Wine. I kind of forgot about that. Right, we've nearly got enough to pack the VMP. Right, we do now. Screw the shield. I'm gonna go... Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Uh-oh. Ah. Right, they're only a two knife with Widow's. That's not bad. Oh, I really want to get through that way, man. Oh, max ammo. Let's go. There we go. We'll reuse the VMP now. I can also go look for the shield pieces now. Okay, this is going really well. We could have had a lot worse. There's the shield visor. And the other one is by Gen 2 or 3. I always get them muddled up. It's not in the wheelbarrow. Which either means it's up here, which I don't think it is, actually. I might be wrong, though. Where does it actually spawn up here? I guess it's not here. It's over here. Yes, it is. Okay, cool. Right, that's the shield built. Oh, we can double pack our weapon as well. Bro, we are racking up the points. Trying to hold off using the, uh, map as much as I can because I don't want it to seem like, oh, well, he's using the gun that isn't at the box. <laughs> right, okay, the Impaler. This weapon was so good, they brought it back in BO4 and they made it terrible. Oh, dead wire, perfect, bro. We don't even really need.
need to be down here. We can go craft a shield, though. We need to hurry up and beat this robot. Oh, my... Oh, I thought he was stepping there. Grab the purple disc. I don't know. We're not going to use it. But, you know, it's just nice to pick up if it's there. Right, let's get this shield built. And there we go. Can I just say as well, what a weird-looking shield for this map. Oh, Panzer. We should be able to, like, absolutely annihilate him. Oh, shit. He's got a hold of me. Oh, don't get too close. There we go. No match for the VMP. I'll grab a max ammo off him as well. We'll get a bit of the knife usage in. Widow's wine has my back, bro. Been a homie since day one. Right, okay, round nine. We're making good progress. We're nearly halfway there. Okay, that's all three robots coming now. Just need to watch out for the feet. Bro, this VMP's great and everything, but I am just worried sick about its ammo count. Like, I feel like we're two rounds in, and I'm already having to worry about it. I don't think it's mag size changes when you pack a bunch of it. I think you just get more stockpile ammo, which is a little bit annoying, but you know. Carpenter, nice. Just slow things down. And a zombie blue. Gonna slow things down even more. There we go. And that is round 10. There's not a whole lot to this map when you get rid of the staffs and all the story, you know? I guess you could argue that with any zombies map, though, really. Oh, no, never mind. We have something to do now. Cheers for that, Max Ammo. Oh, this map was so meant for BO3, man. It's ridiculous how much better this version is compared to the OG BO2 one. I know there's some exploits, like the Claymore thing for high rounded on BO2, but, like, that's the only thing that version really has over this one. If I'm gonna play Origins now, I literally never boot up BO2 unless it's for a video. Got a nuke there. I don't think we've optimized it enough, though. Maybe now we have. Give it a go. Yeah, there we go. Round 11. Right, 150 in the um, stockpile and 40 in the mag. We have 190 bullets to lead us over into the next max ammo. That is worryingly thin. I do enjoy making these simpler types of videos a lot more than the Easter egg ones, to be fair with you. They're just easier to record. It's not like a headache trying to do all the steps and stuff to get like a cog or all four gauntlets of fucking raw. <laughs> I don't know, man. Do you know what I mean, though? It's just this like simpler kind of gameplay. And I like doing them in between the Easter egg videos because it gives you guys more stuff to watch, more variety of stuff to watch instead of just back to back Easter eggs. And I like making them, so it's a win win all around. I do have plans to do a video on BO3 because I've only just clocked. I haven't done a BO3 solo video. I've done it with BO2 guns, but like, it's not vanilla solo. We're definitely going to have to do that at some point. Also, for those who you were watching to the end of the video, it's my dad's birthday today. I want you to say in the comments, right, this proves that you've watched the end of the video. Happy birthday, dad. Wait, that sounds really bad. No, no, scratch that. Say happy birthday, Roman's dad. Let's go. Let's get, let's get that going. Perform 115 head. Already, bro? Oh, shit. We are like nearly right out of ammo. That is not good. Fire staff piece? Not picking that up. Um, can we grab a max ammo from the challenge box? I'm pretty sure we can. Let's go try Gen 6. Let's try beat this robot as well. Right, I'm gonna need a max... Oh, fucking fire staff piece. I'm gonna need a max ammo from this box, bro. Hurry up. That's a weevil, bro. Okay, we got a dead wire out there. Right, shield bash. Right, give me that one. No, not spend 30,000 points. I want this one. That is a max ammo. Right, okay, cool. I would have been so mad there if that drop was a max ammo, but it was just a Widow's Wine Grenade. Right, round 13. Things are starting to get a little bit stressful now. Never thought I'd use stressful in round 13 in the same sentence, but here we are. A again? I was just there. Oh, and I wasted that max ammo as well. We're going to get one off you. And a Panzer, bro. Leave me alone. Bro, that's a that is two max ammos back to back. The game hates me. Oh, get off me. Oh, shield broke. Not good. They don't call the VMP the Impaler for nothing, I think. Oh, my God. But right, there we go. Watch, he'll drop a max ammo as well, I bet. Oh, bro, I literally called it. Oh, my God. Even on BO3, sometimes the mud still gets me, bro. Even though you can literally slide through it if you time it right. All right, okay, round 14. That should hopefully be the last high stress round we got to deal with. Definitely going to have to do some challenge videos on BO1 and BO2. I feel like we don't show that game enough love. You guys seem to love BO3, though, so that's why I do so much of it. But let me know down in the comments if you want to see some be like older titles. We could do some World at War. We haven't even touched World at War once, so I have to give that one a think. I might run a poll later on. Keep your eyes out for that. Okay, yeah, we are very, very low on ammo already. I knew this was going to be an issue right from the minute I picked this gun up, man. If that was a VMP war buy and a BO2 map, where would I be? Right, okay, we're going to need a max ammo or something, man. I guess we're going to have to survive the round with an unpacked Mauser. Would knifing do the trick? I don't know. Oh, is it like a four knife? No, it's three. Okay, that's not terrible. Oh, they are swarming me from every angle, though, because it is like round 15. Like I said, we're only allowed to use the Mauser in like dire situations like this, so I'd say this is pretty dire. Say not like it's doing much, man. We're nearly completely out of ammo in that as well. We don't have any gobblegums that can help apart from like really killjoy. We could try to spin for a killjoy to be fair. Let's get it going. It could be it. It very much could be it. It is, but I'm gonna take it down for it. No. Oh, it doesn't count because I didn't flick it in the air, man. I need to run to grab jug. Ah, shit, 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 shit. Oh my god, I'm literally back to square one. This isn't even fair. If there's been a VMP war buy on this map this entire time, I'm gonna be so annoyed. I don't know where it would be, though. Yeah, I was gonna say, it might be there. That's the Argus. 
It's not here, the cooler's here. Oh my god, please just bless me up quick with something I can use. Dead a nuclear winter, that's good enough actually. Grab that, grab quick revive. Death machine, definitely something we can use. What's this? Killjoy, that's what I wanted. Make quick use of this death machine here and then we'll go back to worrying about what I'm going to kill the zombies with when I don't have any more killjoys. It's a zombie blood. All right, okay, this round. I'm not going to grab a perkaholic because I feel like we need to hold on to these killjoys more than I do get like perks. Because yeah, jug and widow's wine and stuff are not... What the... F oh, oh, it's one of these rounds. Okay, that works out, actually. Oh, perfect. That was like a line in the stars, bro. That was meant to happen. Oh my god, get away from me. I don't want to lose my other quick revive, please. And it uses Killjoy to its fullest potential. You don't not die. We do have ammo now, which is good. I'm going to go try run and grab Juggernog, though. Dylan W? Bro, bro is that my long-lost brother? Dylan W? Thank you for subscribing. Oh my god. I need a shield as well. I've only just clocked. Grab that. I need to run past this foot as well. Bro, Origins is actually hard with our staff, man. Oh my god, we're nearly out of ammo again, man. Oh, I pray we don't get the VMP again. It's a good weapon. It just has no ammo. All right, okay, round 17. Three more to go. We can do this. We can do this. We have another Killjoy we can pop. We're chilling, bro. Oh, God, maybe we're not chilling. That's a panzer. I need to save this ammo. I'm popping the Killjoy now. Oh, my God, bro. It's my lucky day. And another... Oh, bro, I'm chilling. Where's this panzer? I've just heard him spawn in. There he is. Get off me. Talk about fucking touchy-feely. Jesus, okay. What's that? What's he dropped? Insta-kill. Perfect. I'm gonna do a big brain play here and use the shield to bash them away. Unlike BO4, though, we can't repair it, which is really annoying. That was probably one of the best features they ever made with that game. Although I don't like paying 2500 for a shield that goes in about four hits when I get up to like round 34 on like Voyage when I'm doing the Easter egg, but you know. Oh my god, that's another max ammo. Right, let's try and use this one to its fullest potential. If I can actually push towards it though. Oh my god, please, no, 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 no! I hate the Origins mud, bro. It's so over. And that max ammo is going to be gone by the time I get to it. Oh, just get me out of the mud, man. So much for me wanting to be a better zombies player and, you know, use the ammo I have first before grabbing that one. What a waste of time. No. Right, dead wire. Please do your thing. Insta kill. Ooh. Oh, nuke. Oh, my God. And breathe. Right, I need a perkaholic or something, man. Right, one more round. One more round. We got this. I think, right? Let's spin the wonder fizz just in case. Run over here. Run back to here. What did we get? Widow's wine. It's just as well that we got that, actually. Round robin. I don't want... That's a, that's a, that's a cheap way out. I'm not doing that. Oh, how do we get through this round, man? We have 11 bullets. We have a round robin, but that is such a cheap way out. Doesn't mean I don't want to use gobblegum to finish it off. It just means I don't want to use a fucking round robin on the last round. Can they give me, like, a killjoy or something, please? No, a shot and freeze, not what I asked for. Let's try loop round and grab something here. Please, just bless me up, please. Oh, no, it's... Oh, is it over? Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, we just about got out of that. Okay, use a little thing called a shield blast. Hence how my shield is broken now. I need another one. Wait, we could probably use the shield here. It can take a few hits, right? Yeah, it can. Okay. Okay, grab another shield. Oh my god, hang on. We might actually be able to clear the round. No. Death machine. Oh my god, there we go. We did it. Okay, round 20. Right, that is Origins completed. And with that, the video is over. Thank you all so much for watching, guys. If you did enjoy this video, make sure you drop a like on it. And if you want to see more content like this, why don't you subscribe? It's completely free and you can always change your mind later. With all that said, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you all in the next video.